Hearts. This is a strategy 4X turn-based thing. Um, civilization with fantasy or, or um, uh, um, what's the, um, magic. Um, uh, not Heroes of Might and Magic, but Master of Magic um, style of thing. And, and you'll see that when we get in here. You know, build a, build a, an empire, um, send your lizardmen or dwarves or goblins or whatever out into the world to conquer and all that. It does have some very interesting and kind of neat things that's added into there. So, uh, we're gonna check it out tonight and see what the new stuff is all about. There is a beta version of which what I what I have right now. The dev is still working on it. Been working on it forever, even though it came out in 2018 full release. They're still working on it, and uh, we're checking out the beta it's a deity. But we're gonna call it uh, deity. It sounds fancy today. So anyway, uh, let's play the game. Uh, we've got basically one option. There is mods in the game, which I haven't put anything in there. I have one for Europe, city names, whatever. Well, that's not going to be in there. But I guess there's mods you can pick up on the Steam page. Um, we're going to jump into a new game here, and we get to choose several different folks we can choose from. Several races we can choose from. We've got, if we go with the evil deity, we can be the Blood Orcs, the Mud Goblins, or the Dark Elves. Uh, if we play a neutral deity, we can be the Northmen, the Grey Gnomes, the Lizard Nymph. Thank you very much, Big Dog, for 10 months. We've got the Good Deity allows us to play the High Men, the Mountain Dwarves, and the Wood Elves. <clears throat> Why is a Higgs boson always allowed into a church? Without them, we wouldn't have mass. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, and then for the other ones, like, um, I think it just has to do with whether you are a good or neutral or whatever deity, but each of these, you can choose these races that go along with it. So we're basically, we're building our, uh, we're building our sorcerer. That's who we begin with. Our, our, we're building our deity. Um, so our deity's name is going to be Undinti. And Undinti is going to be, oh, uh, I don't know who we're going to pick. I don't really know that this matters too much. Um, because what we're going to do is we're going to come in here and we're gonna choose our deity abilities and the spell books we get with our deity before we jump into the game. So I think we're going to go with, this is the dwarf guy. He's a good guy though, so we can be high men, mountain dwarves, or wood elves. We might be, we might be dwarves. Nothing wrong with that. High-spirited, rotund, and red-headed. Uh, devoutly religious, as the high men, mountain dwarves are plump, red-skinned, jovial folk. Love of ale. Um, I'm not opposed to being dwarves. I was playing around with this a little earlier, and I was playing as the... Where is it? The lizard men. And because I saw something about krakens and things, but uh, I, I know I'm going to get yelled at if I don't play dwarves, so we'll be dwarves today. We'll go with a nice... A, a strong color of yellow. Now, as for our 30 points we have to spend, what do we put them into? Um, basically, you can you right click on anything and see what they do. These are There's different ways of, of, of building these things. You can either go like as a big spellcaster throwing out summoning animals and, and beasts and... Uh, yeah, Aeloloth. Um, <laughs> that should be my name. Uh, we, or we can go into things like... Um, uh, I think Inspiring gives us a, a, a morale boost... Uh, we've got Merchant gives us more trade goods. We've got Rich. We start with more money. Uh, there's one of them here with Warlord. We get more experience. We're going to take that one. And um, what I've figured out is uh, is we'll start with some Rich. And yeah, <clears throat> you make a good point, Big Dog. If you are a Dominions or Conquest of Elysium fan, then this game is kind of in your uh, in your, your wheelhouse. Um, as for my spellbooks... I think I want to go with Nature 5, and there's a reason for this. And I believe we'll do a little bit of... Holy will give us, like, spells. We'll put a little bit of Holy and then maybe a little bit... Well, you know what? Let's do a little Nature and a little Fire. Something like that. And then the other 10, I want to put into... I think I want to put it into... Where is the... Ex Ooh, ooh, taxes, 10%. I like the sound of that. Uh, expansionist. I think we want expansionist. So we expand faster. Settlers are cheaper to make. Um, Daddy starts with one extra starting unit. Whenever he gains morale, they have 50% chance to gain one additional morale. Yeah, yeah. Inspiring. An inspiring administrator. That's what I want. Closer to Civ and Dominion. You're right, you're right. All right, so we're going to be uh, Umtinti of the Dwarves. And we're going to play against a few different folks. Uh, I don't know how many we want to put in here. We'll throw in a few. I don't really know uh, that. And as far as also the game options, there's a million options we can change in here. Or a few, I guess. 
Uh, we're gonna leave it as it is. You can even change like the size of the cities or how tough the difficulty of the AI is. We'll leave them on normal. Uh, the game speed, all that kind of stuff. <laughs> throw in there. Hey, thanks, Jeff. Um, layer density. Uh, layers are an interesting, interesting thing, and uh, that's that's one of the things I really like about this, uh, which I find neat. So we'll we'll see what that all that is. So we can also click and review our world if we want. We're gonna go with a with a nice flat world. Um, I want. Um, I'm gonna keep everything on average. Yeah. Last time I played this game, I was on like a tiny island, which wasn't exciting. So let's let's not have so many small islands. Let's keep a nice nice 60 by 40 world. We're not gonna peek at the map. We're gonna let it go out. So welcome to my first game of Deity Empires. I was on my other computer, so it uh, is not my first game of Deity Empires. Also, I played this four years ago on the channel, and uh, if you saw that video back then, you're gonna be surprised because things look a lot different than they did back then. In fact, they look a lot different. Uh, when I played back then, it was like uh, top-down 2D. I mean, it's 2D here, but it, it was just like squares moving around around the map. It ain't like that anymore. So, um, I'll give a little rundown of what's going on here and to try to explain what's happening. Uh, basically, I, I am in, if you've played Master of Magic, think of that where I'm a, um, I'm, I'm a caster and I can do things like cast spells. I don't really know any spells yet. I need to learn some spells. And so I'm going to put my, my efforts into learning those spells. So we're going to do some research and learn some spells. I have chosen uh, the nature magic because I want spiders. I think we also get... Uh, yeah, we also get some ants if we want. We also get birds as well. We can summon as well. Um, and so that's why we put uh, nature in there. So we're, what we want to do is we're going to put our efforts into just learning some things. Let's go ahead and grab... Uh, let's grab thorns for right now. So we're going to research thorns. Magic research. But there's also civic research, which is what my seed is going to look at. Don't get overwhelmed. Right now, we're gonna work on farms. Don't, that's all we need to worry about. We're working on working on making our farms better, which is really all that does. And actually, as it goes into here, this farm will unlock all kinds of other things, which basically just higher farm levels, better ranch levels, um, better trapping methods. So it doesn't really do too much. Um, my army of Untinti right here has has th four warriors in it, a engineer and a settler. I like how the Settler is a Conestogo wagon, hearkening back to the days of Civ 1. I like it. I appreciate it. Uh, the other thing that's interesting about this game is the way the layers work. We'll get all the, get to all that stuff. I'll, I'll, uh, we'll, we'll get there. But for right now, uh, let's go. And I think we I think we get a bonus World Dwarves. We get a big bonus being in the hills. So I think I'm going to run and go right... I think I'm going to go right here and build my city right there. Uh, I think he's out, he's out of turns, isn't he? Yeah, so we can't build a city right there. Well, next turn, we'll build our city right there. And, oh, you know what? I don't think I can, actually. Is this the one? One of these buttons. I forget. That one is like a uh, s city availability. Uh, I don't remember which one it is, though. Um, okay. Um, but we, we, I think we're too close to that, so we actually can't build there. Can we build here? Maybe next turn. We're going to build in the hills. I'm going to go there so I can get that thing. So our season going to have a rank of, range of two. So we can go out, grab that guy. We won't be able to have the water here. Maybe we just go here. Be in the hills. Get the furs. Um, yeah, that's going to be a good spot right there, I think. And um, I'll go over my meditation and battle mana and, and all this stuff behind my head here. Uh, as far as what spell we're going to cast, we're going to start out with... I think we're just going to get ourselves a hero to begin with. And then we'll see where that goes. Is it F5? I thought it was F... Oh, there it is. Okay, there it is. I don't know why... Yeah, it's right there. I, th I hate that. Owner radius is what I hit. So you get to hit it a few times. Okay. Okay. Right, turn that one off. Turn that one off. Okay, there we go. All right, in the turn. So, I think... And I don't know. Do I want to go here? Or do I want to go a little bit up there? Let's go right... I don't know. Let's, let's, let's go there and build our city. There it is. Uh, Gegdug. No. 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 This is Nookstone. Nookstone has 500 folks. Hey, Avic. Well, thanks for the raid, Avic. You guys are here right at the very beginning. I'm just now explaining things. I love cats. Delicious. Our backpack, great. Backpack is great. We all know about backpack. 
backpack has a special meaning here on this channel as well. All right, so uh, I've just named my town, my main capital city. We've just settled our town. This is Deity Empires. It is a civilization with fantasy. Think of it that way. Or, um, yeah, this is what Daz was playing. The other day when we raided, we raided Daz playing this game. This is what, That's what reminded me of this game. I had played this one four years ago, back when it first came out. And has, I noticed when I was watching him play it, it's changed a lot since then. So um, we're going to do, uh, we'll do a little tour here. We're still continuing our tour. Uh, there's Nook Stone. We've got an army of dwarves. Uh, we're working on building ourselves a leader. We've got research going into farms. And what we're going to do, basically the whole point of the game, of course, is to conquer the world. And that's right. I played it before. It was cool. That's right. Back <laughs> sure. Uh, what we want to do is go out and see if first start by making our town bigger. Right? We know how to play these games. So let's go to the build tree and let's work on getting a uh, a builder's workshop. This is going to unlock. Okay, it looks like one of my like supply chain games. Whatever I'm playing, it's like me playing Satisfactory or something. You know, it's just a mess. But we're going to go and get ourselves a builder's workshop because this is going to unlock all kinds of other things that we can make in our town. Like you know, temples and and uh, and granaries and and that kind of stuff is all from the builder's workshop. So we start off by making that thing. If we want to make town stuff, it's over there. We are producing... Uh, where's my production? Uh, production. We're making ten things uh, each turn, which goes over there. And we can make units over here. Now, we know how that works. You you get resources, you make stuff. This game does it a little different. And thank you, Squid and Cecil, for following. Uh, we are making... We're bringing in ten resources. We're, we can produce ten of that. So, what that means is you could have a town that's like... All lumberjacks or or mines or whatever. And all of that, those resources don't do you any good until you turn it into production. So you could have one town that just makes all these resources and then ships it over to another town that just does all the production. And then you can have like a stockpile of resources and have like specialized towns that aren't necessarily the production towns, but they're the resource gathering towns. Same thing with food, where or sort of like food. Food's going to give you people... Um, Magic research is also something that is important in there as well. And, um, yeah, there's, there's a lot of numbers. Do you like numbers? Because that's this game likes numbers. Anyway, we're making ourselves a builder's workshop to start off with. As our, uh, our folks are going to go running around here. We're going to send off our warriors off into... Uh, we're going to go to this outdoor lair. There's, some three, there's two mud goblins over here. We hate mud goblins. So we're going to go get them. My, uh, my worker here is going to go step over to these hills, and he's going to make us a farm. So, if you look in here, this spot here is producing... It produces 400 food, but because I'm a mountain dwarf, it gives me 600 more, so it gets 1,000 food working in this hill. It also gives me a resource. Um, if I build a farm on it, it's going to give me 25% uh, more. Plus, remember we saw the tech tree? It can give me even more of that. So we're going to build a farm. It'll be interesting. Uh, Rose, thanks for following. When do we get robes? Uh, so, um, the other cool thing about this, there's, there's, there's two things about this that stand out that I think are really neat. And that's the resource thing, resource production. The other neat thing is, is the layers. So this is just an outdoor layer, outdoor layer, uh, outdoor layer, uh, dungeon. Okay, so this is a dungeon. Dungeon level five. So when you go into there, uh, it's almost like playing... Like a, like a roguelike, I suppose. You you go into the dungeon layer. It looks like a looks like a looks like a, a, a dungeon, and then you traverse the lower levels of the dungeon, getting loot and all that kind of stuff with your army. So kind of a neat thing. Uh, you can see my army here is a strength of thirteen ninety six. These guys are a strength of two eighty six. So we're gonna go over there, and take them out, and pass some time. As we do that, so let's go march in here and get to some combat. What's this over here? Ooh, a big, a big, ooh, oh, that's a fancy one. There's zombies in there. Okay, okay. There's some uh, kobolds that way. We got some outdoor lair. There's a dwarf rebel leader. We hate that guy. Like, Heroes of Might and Magic, closer to, I mean, kind of, but I would say closer to Mad, Ma Master of Magic. But yeah, kind of like that. So we, we go on the over map and we go in the, the fighty map. Now, this is all turn-based kind of thing, and uh, you want numbers. There's your numbers. If you are a Dominions or uh, Conquest of Elysium fan, then this is where these numbers pop up. What kind of rate, what kind of damage we're doing, our hit chance, 
uh, how many strikes we get, and each unit also has different kinds of attacks. These guys just have axes, but there's other units that have multiple attacks that they can do. If I want to cast spells, I can do that here as well. Like, I can throw in... I got nothing, so I can just extend battle, whatever that does. Uh, but if I had, like, a, like a summon a spider, I could do that now. So I'm going to bounce up and and uh, head forward. Probably what I'm going to do tonight, just because rather than spending most of the night playing these battles out, we're going to... Um, oh, here we go. Here's my, my battle tutorial. Uh, if we had more, more attacks, it'd be right there. So we get one for the Dwarven Axe. We had two for, like, the throwing a knife or whatever. Uh, it'd be this way. So he's, he moved... How much did he move? He moved... Uh, Where's his move? I don't remember what it was. I wasn't watching. Uh, missed it. Uh, we should probably try to stay out of his range. Battle moves four, so we should we should like stay away from him. So one, two, three, four. So he's gonna come up. He's gonna be able to get in our range. So uh, we'll just get there on him. Up here. Uh, whoops. Uh, oh, my range. Yeah, let's get him. There we go. So we we hit him for five. There's a there's a thing here telling us what happened. Uh, it takes four damage. We rolled. Uh, uh, let's go to the top here. So we attack the goblin, and, and and depending on how many people are in my troop, how many times we attack, there's your numbers if you want numbers. We did a lot of bad rolling. We rolled a lot of zeros. He rolls his armor. He only takes so much damage. He attacks back, that kind of thing. Swing at him again, and, and all bad. There we go. We got him. Okay. So, also, uh, if you want to play more like Dominions or, or uh, Conquest of Elysium, you can just hit auto battle. Uh, ideally, you don't want to do this. Um, because a big part of the game is getting your units experience, because they all level up. You can give them items, and, uh, um, of course leveling them up, them up is, is ideal. And the, the unit that gets the killing blow gets the experience. I think that's how it still is. And so, you want to, like, you could, like, prioritize units getting their, getting the, the skill levels, right? Uh, so we got 4 gold and 33 and 33 food on the battlefield. Which these guys were walking around with sandwiches in their pockets. Uh, but also, in the lair, we found some more gold, some more food, and some more natural resources. Which, remember, we can take those back to town to get them turned into production. And some experience rewarded to our hero here. Now, also, uh, this guy here, um, Mountain Warrior number one, you'll notice, is... Uh, where is it at? Uh, maybe not this guy. Uh, this guy. Not, not this guy. Yeah, mountain. Yeah, number one. Number one has those thirteen resources on him in his pocket, and so if we want those resources to go back, we have to go back into our borders and drop them off, or we can continue on a killing. Our strength has gone down a little bit because we're a little beat up, but uh, I think we're gonna go on a killing because I hear there's kobolds over here, and we hate kobolds. Diplomatic message waiting. Uh, looks like Bor Bozork has met us. Pathetic. Inferior. Weak. He's not very nice about himself. We can we can chat back with him and say, how about peace? He's not the nicest guy. Uh, there. And, and yeah, we, we met him. Where is he at? Oh, there he is. So he's pretty close to us. Alright. Um, Alright, well, surely he won't come all the way down here. Let's go ahead and take out this thing. What is it? A bunch of kobolds? We're gonna let it just auto. We go. We got some food, resources, some mithril. Kill the one kobold. Uh, our guys, we can just we'll we'll rest them, you know, and they'll get strength again. There's the dungeon lair. Now you may think, oh, we're a 1200 strength. They're 151 strength. Easy. That's 151 strength on the first level, though. And then the next level is gonna be more strength. You know, it's gonna get more and more difficult. So, ideally, we have we need more units before we go in there. We could go in there and clear it out just by clearing the first level. I think's how it works, but um, we don't want to do that. So let's go ahead and make our way back uh, home as soon as we can. We watching the uh, oh we're watching the enemy. All right, uh, we got our thorns research is done. Now work on our bark skin and our food research is up to, is done as well. We can go take a look at those. So uh, uh, thorns is done, which is a spell we can cast in combat. Uh, what I really want is how's this tree end? Summons a lesser tree end out of the for out of forest terrain. Uh, he only works in battle. Uh, we also got these uh, these birds, which is only 200 to get that. And the spider's 450. There is a kind of a downside, I think, to summoning these things. It's nice because they won't kill my units, but they won't be getting experience if they get the kills. So, anyway, he's still working on that farm. What is he doing up here? He's going to go take that, uh, that, that beetle lair up there, I think. Nope. 
All right, uh, let's go back on this way. Uh, one thing about town here is we have two workers in town right now. And these two workers are working on the the hills here, the city hills here. So we're making 2,000 2, food because they're here in town. But there's a road here, so they get like a 1% bonus for that. There's a resource here, so we're getting that brought in every turn. And you can see that popping in each each turn. Um, when we get to 1,000 people in town, which we are almost there, we'll get an extra worker. And then just like civilization or whatever, he's going to go and work wherever he wants to work. So, um, that is, uh, yeah, we got 10 more for that, so that's good. So, uh, next up, I think, let's go ahead and put a road over here. Um, having a road, I, I, if I remember correctly, it allows, it, it allows me, it's going to give you a little bit of a boost, but also is going to give me the ability to have an extra uh, worker in that spot. So, uh, we got to build a workshop up next to working on trade goods. No, no, uh, why don't you make me? Why don't you work on... There's boats. Uh, we got schools, which will give me some magic and civic research. We have this mana conduit, which will give us more mana, uh, which we can use for, like, summoning our, our buddy come in here. Um, we've got uh, a warehouse we can make. We've got a worshipping hall, which gives us a shrine. Um, Craftsman workshop. I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to focus on... This doesn't take me too. Oh, this is the Mason's Guild, which, which allows all kinds of other things. Hospitals and inns and miners' guilds and all that stuff. Theaters. Let's get... Do we want the mana, or do we want... Um, let's get a small warehouse started up first. Uh, no, no, let's get the worshipping hall. Oh, that'll be good. Uh, and then... Um, we get this one done yet? Okay, so we're working on that production research, which is fine. It'll make our resource gathering better. And then once that's done, we're going to go work on making our farm a little better. We're going to go in farming techniques one. Increases food harvest on farms by 2%. That'll be next. So that, after that one, we'll go there. Okay, now that we're in range of our town, he still has those resources on us. So we have to tell him, drop it off. Drop that stuff off. And... Oh, we also can hunt for food as well. Check that out. So let me go and uh, I think we're gonna go. It's gonna be too tough for us until we get a leader. When he pops in, we'll be we'll be better. Which what, where is that coming along? Oh, not that one. Uh, this one. Yeah, we're nowhere near there. So there's some sort of I don't remember exactly how it works, but we get like our meditation, which is forty, um, and our mana which is 10, those are getting factored into what, like, the 10's going into the spell casting, but we can't spend more than we have meditation. Hey, Joe Bird. And uh, so there's all kinds of factors in there with that. But I don't know them all real well. Sorry. Uh, let's go to Angel. Thanks for following. Let's go. We'll run back out over, that's 600, though. I mean, we may lose to that. Those fire beetles. Uh, let's just go get these three bandits. There could be something exciting over here. We know these orcs are up this way. I don't want to do anything too scary before we, um, before our hero shows up. There's a tiger over there. We can handle a tiger. Let's do these bandits. We got it. We got it. They're just bandits. Uh, my guys all have experience, and that is all listed here somewhere. Um, I think it's in... I don't remember where it is. Oh, here it is. Uh, we're at level 1. Two more experience, and he'll be a level 2. And... They're almost all the same, but this guy's a little less, because this guy doesn't seem to be getting any kills. So, I'm just... Well, maybe I shouldn't auto this one, because they're going to give me one. Is that a skull there? There's a skull on the ground. Who put that there? Uh, I don't know. When did you send? When did you? When did you send the picture, Jobert? They don't go very fast, do they? I'm gonna stand over here and get ready for them. I don't know if we should fight on the hills. That probably would be better, wouldn't it? Okay, 
one down. Let's get up to these hills here. There we go. Okay, done. Uh, we got some gold, we got some food, we got some gold, we got some food, resources. And we got some fame. Okay, sometimes we'll find items which we can put on our, our heroes. Oh, yeah, 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 Bob Ross, I saw, yeah, I saw that one. Good stuff. Uh, okay, next turn. What's his uh, strength at? 858, we're at 14, we're gonna go get this tiger. Basically cleaning up this stuff, and just getting all these resources and bringing them back. It's kind of a neat thing with the resources because uh, I suppose you can give different ways of playing the game, right? Just rather than just being a build an empire, you know, typical style. Um, we could build a town which doesn't really have any resources gathering. We get the resources by going out and getting them ourselves and bringing the resources back and producing stuff. Which I think is kind of neat. Giving a different way of playing. There are the orcs. Hello, orcs. Uh, we're a little beat up now, so let's not go fighting. But they're right next to us. There's a white dragon over there. Um, we could probably handle that 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 um, that wizard. We have thorns. Let's uh, we'll see what happens. Okay, production resources is done. Working on those farming techniques now. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna fight that guy. I kind of want to. Let's just go, um... He's gonna go for that, isn't he? Well, maybe we'll get him afterwards. Let's go in the hills. If he goes into that, we're gonna get him. Hopefully he doesn't go this way. We do have an archer tower. We got a garrison. So we're not, we're not terribly scared. We can always whip out someone real quick if we want to. Uh, over here, so the specializations are... Does it tell me here? Uh, it doesn't tell me here. But I think right-clicking on it does. So if, if we select one of these, it just gives us kind of a boost in that area. Like, if we have an idea what the town's going to be, whether it's going to be a trade good making town or a uh, mercenary appeal or farming or whatever we want, we can we can focus that if we want. Uh, it seems like a big point of the game, or a big uh, uh, focus of the game, is to make sure towns have a, like, a distinction. I think, um, I think it seems to be a, the, the, uh, a focus. I think I missed a hydrate from a long time ago. Uh, dad jokes are once every, uh, I think, 40 minutes, 45 minutes, 50 minutes, somewhere in there. I just changed it. I just lowered it. I forgot what it was. If I put them on a new timer, then then I wouldn't have a stream. It'd be, all be dad jokes. Okay, worshiping hall is done. Let's go and work on... Uh, you may see this, this settler is coming in on its own. It's slowly coming in all, all by itself. Um... So, let's go work on... Yeah, let's go ahead and get a, get a warehouse. Sure. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's get that. I think I'd, yeah, get rid of that. Just, just work on the school first. Magic seems good. Occasionally, we'll get some mercenaries come in here. We'll hire them when they when they show up. Um, we're going for it. We're going to get that wizard. Ouch! Where is he? What'd you go into that for? Uh, we may we may actually lose this. Uh, my spells. I have thorns, right? Because a friendly unit to the Thorns buff, doing 1 to 2 physical damage to melee attackers. Does me no good in this combat. Okay. Okay. Alright. How many fireballs could he possibly have? He's just a wizard. Ouch. Okay, I don't know if we're going to win this one. Can we run away? <laughs> Let's auto battle this one. we got to run. Run faster. Oh, he's got doggies. Oh, good, good miss. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I want to make sure that... I want to cast a spell. Um, thorns on him. Okay. Whose turn is it? My turn? Uh, no one's turn. Okay. Okay, good, good. No more missing. Okay, there we go. Good job. Uh, let's go. Can I have more? I do have more more mana to spend. Let's put thorns on. I don't really matters. We'll put it on him. Okay. Can you move? You guys have all moved, right? This mage is starting to get on my nerves. 
Probably not not the best um, idea to go <laughs> into this combat. Oh, he's going to destroy us. He is destroying us. I don't have any offensive spells. Ooh, good, good, good. He's just a wizard. How tough can he be? Miss! How can you miss a wizard? We're going to lose. <laughs> Maybe not. Oh, we can't kill him, though. There he goes. Oh, man. There goes my army. It's okay. We didn't like them anyway. Let's go hire a mountain dwarf warrior. You know, it was all that exploring. I, I, I hope I, I, I gave you a, a good example of, of, uh, of poor play. Um, I hope you're happy. Uh, let's build a lumber camp over here. It's going to be some resources. We don't have the people. We got one extra uh, worker spot who's working this that farm. Give us more food. We'll get that. That worked, and then we can go get that. Actually, I probably should go down here. This is a forested hill, which gives me, what, one natural resource and the animal skins as a trade good. And an extra natural resource. This is a th dense jungle, which gives me three. Yeah, we should go work on the, f the skins. So change my mind. Go, go down here, buddy. Uh, I'm not sure. I, I can cancel my next turn. Yeah, OP wizards. That's what it was. Can I tell you to move? How do I tell you to cancel that job? I just disbanded you, didn't I? That's not the button I wanted to hit. Not the button. This is going poorly. <laughs> okay. Hit the, don't hit the little X. I never hit the little X before. I wasn't sure what the little X did. I learned. Alright, we've researched summon flock of birds, which would have come in real handy a few turns ago. And bark skin's coming up next. We also know some better farming techniques, which means our, our farms can be better. Uh, it's a level 1 of 2 farm. Um, we're gonna go and get ourselves an engineer, but we're gonna put him at the bottom after the, the, we'll get a fighter first, and then we'll get our engineer. It's not a big deal because we can't work that yet anyway, so, you know. All right, we have a message, uh, from Thrawn has met us. Construction is complete in Nook Stone. We've got our mount, our war, our dwarf warrior. Up next is an engineer. Got it. Um... Greetings, says Thrawn. I hope we can live in a relatively in relative harmony as neighbors. Hello, Thrawn. Oh, you're a dwarf too. All right, all right. I can give you a gift if I want, but no, we uh, we've squandered enough stuff. Uh, where, where are you? Here you are. North. You're the Northman. Okay. All right. So we have an army now. He's only 300 strength though, so he's not gonna do really anything until we get our guy in. Um. We know we're going to stay away from wizards, that's for sure. So we'll use them just to kind of like look around the place. What's that? Uh, I don't know about the fire beetle. I want to look at the, the wood. I want to know about the terrain. Hmm. Let's just do a little scouting with this guy. Looks like we're on the southern edge of the map. It's all cold down here. There's some wood elf rebel leaders. Wood elves are going to throw bows at, or throw arrows at me. Okay, next up is road building. Uh, well, that was that was this one. Um, sure we're not really building any roads yet. We do have a road, actually. Maybe maybe we will. Efficiency bonus when they when they own five or fewer cities, we get an efficiency bonus. This one allows us our makes our walls better. This one carrying capacity, transporter device knowledge. Probably want to get some. Yeah, this one. Let's prospect a tile by 20% or mining. Increase from natural resources harvested by mines by a small percent. We want that one because we're going to get some mines in these hills. That's what we should probably be doing. Being dwarves and all. Hey, we got Mount, uh, we got mercenaries. We're going to hire this guy. He costs 110 bucks to hire. And so uh, we got to keep, you know, we got to feed him and all that. But he's definitely worth it. So we're going to hire this guy. So he's basically just a free, free soldier. Uh, unit skate unit in city specialization bonus unit training one. Okay, that's that guy, I guess. I'm gonna send him down here to meet up with him, and we'll have him join uh, forces. Is he actually holding a grenade? I think he is. 
Okay, we'll mo group these guys together. And uh, how are we doing on that spell there? Well, we're getting there. We're getting there. You can see my mana's gone up by one point. Um, he's almost there also, so... Okay, construction complete. We've got our engineer. I'm next to building a school, which I like. Bark skin is done. Next, we have animate a lesser tree ent. For magic research, I think I want to go... I mean, I also have some sort of uh, damage dealer. We do have the the birds we can throw at people. We could like stone skin ourselves. I want this. I want the spider. Let's get that spider done. Then if we get attacked, we can just throw that spider on somebody. Uh, is he done? Uh, yeah, I want. I want. Uh, I want him. How do I click on the guy? Here we go. Uh, you guys. So I think we're gonna go down here. Now we've got. Don't hit the X. Uh, I want to look at the terrain. Here, we'll do it this way. So this terrain can hold one worker. It provides a thousand food. Work in this thing. It also provides um, zero resources. No, no, no. It'll provide one resource per worker because of resource there. Uh, there's a bonus resource of animal skins. If we get trappers tents on there, we'll get the animal skins, which will give us three trade goods. So let's do that. Let's put the trappers tents there. Okay, mine tech's done. Next up is road building one. It's fine. Um, let's send this guy away from that wizard. We have explored all that stuff. Let's go explore up here. Another wizard. We stay away from those. There's beetles around. And... There's a wolf there. There's a kobold lieutenant. Young green dragon. A naga. Ooh, fire, fire wizard. Four of them. Oh, we ain't going there. Tough stuff over here. Uh, oh, that's a, I was about to say, that's an easy one. No, it's a, no, we're not going there. However, we have the birds now. We can probably take them out this time, but... I'm not going back until I'm ready. I'm scared of that guy now. Skellies. And the problem is, also, we had just done a, a, another combat before that. So we had, like, resources and things. Okay, mercenaries have offered their services. We got a uh, Dwarf Musketeer. And we also have um, a spell done. Let's go and... I'm going to increase my meditation skill. I think what is what I want to be working on now. So that goes up higher. We can spend more mana. And also... We've got the dwarf, mountain dwarf musketeer, old Rurker. Higher on him. We're higher on Gook as well. Um, oh, did I, did I say Max? I think it was Max. So let's go send, oop, oop. send him up here. You done with that already? Uh, go ahead and build a road and we'll work it on back. Uh, let's go ahead and meet up. With our guy here. With this guy. Oh, Roar Kerr here. So this guy's a hero. Hero, of course, and have items equipped. And uh, he, once he gets like certain levels, he'll get cooler uh, as he goes. He's got a gun. So he's de de definitely heroic. So we'll make sure we get him met up with, with our buddies. And you can see he's got a strength of 876. Him alone is stronger than these two. Okay, road is um, building session complete. We got a school done. Next up is trade goods. Let's go and change that over to... Hey, steak, how's it going? Um, let's do this mana thing. And get us some bonus mana in here. And we'll hire this guy. Was it four? Is that what that was? No. Okay. Uh, we got ourselves a, uh, our, our, our settler. So you can see the settler keep on, kind of just keeps going by itself. We could we could force it along, but also kind of does its thing on its own. So we're gonna leave that uh, and go build ourselves a town. Let's go put one. Um, what was the button? F five. Not really any available so like city spots around. There's one right there. Um, if we clear out a couple of these spots, we can put it over there. I'm not sure this is the best place, but we can get like the fish. I think these guys are really good, but I can't see it. 
for food. Ideally, we, we were best in, in hills, so ideally we go and we clear this stuff out. And we could try going over there where those hills are. Be right next to the orcs. If we go north, there's the logs there. We can do this up here, I think. It's tough, but we could do it with soldiers. Let me just um, hang on to this settler for right now. I think, I'm gonna, I think we're going to go meet up over here. Oh, a wizard. We want to take out that fire beetle, you think? We can, we can handle that? I don't know. Um, is there a warrior? Yeah. Come out here. Oh, a human pikeman. Uh, I got money for you. You're 210. I'll take you. How much money do we have? I got plenty of money. Yeah, I'll tire that pikeman. And make up for our, uh, our screw up before. So bring him up. Uh, you can meet up with him. I want uh, you guys to come meet up with this guy. We'll just build our army right here. And then we'll have strength. 19 plus the 5. Yeah, we can handle the fire beetle then. Plus my spell. Uh, we're working on that. Um, the spider's not going to be here anytime soon. We could try to get burning weapon. That might help some things. But uh, you know, we've got the birds. We'll be fine. I saw that movie. I'm pretty sure they're they're they're, they're good. Join up with them. Okay, now everybody, let's go get ourselves a fire beetle. All right. So we got range units now. This guy now has a gun. Uh, he also has two different attacks. He's got a musket and a dagger. So the, the musket is range. The dagger, of course, is melee. Uh, and these guys are the same thing. They can throw throw, throw grenades, which is great. Um. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to move everyone up to, like, here. And we're just going to sort of wait for them to, to come to us. What do fire beetles do? They bite, right? Surely they bite. Strike, damage, like, physical damage to the fight. Yeah, yeah, he just bites a couple times. So when he gets to us... Okay, like, right now. Now, uh, ideally, the best way to do this is to have your hero be the one that gets the experience. Because he gets really cool when he gets experience. So I kind of want everyone to get up here and, like, do some damage. And then we're going to let him take the shot and clean it up. That way he gets the kill. I know it's kind of cheesy. Ooh, he might be able to do it right now, actually. Blast him. Hey, you got him. There we go. We got the experience as well. So we found some mana, some food. We got some gold, food, resources, mithril, and some fame. Uh, so now our buddy here, Rorker. Can I change your name? Oh, I can I can change your name. Well, your name is going to be... What's your name going to be? Um, uh, uh, I saw I got a hate... Uh, I got a hydrate from Mango. Your name's going to be Mango. Mango, De Mango Delights. So, Mango is our... Our, um, our hero here, who just gained some experience. He's level 2 already. Um, I think when he gets level 5 is when he gets real cool. This spot... Um, thanks, Gatekeeper. Yes, my gatekeeper. And that turn there. Um, that road's done. Let's go back here and build a road here. And we're going to ease our settler on up this way. Okay, so we got to clear out these things here. We want to go for the... We want to try to get that wizard first. Um, let's do it. Let's go for it. All right, it's wizard time. It's wizard time. It's dad joke time. There's lightning bolts all over the place. All right, so, you know, uh, I was watching this uh, this Australian baking show. And uh, the audience, for some reason, they just, like, lost their minds, clapping and excited whenever this uh, whenever the chef was making making a meringue. And I thought, oh, yeah, that's kind of weird, you know? I, I, I'm not from Australia, but I thought... I thought Australians usually boomerang. 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 <laughs> anyway, anyway, wizards. There's wizards out there. Let's cast a spell. So we can summon flocks of birds. And we're gonna. Can I put it right here? No, I think it has to be within range. I don't know where I can put it. Uh, right there. I can put it. Get them birds out there. 
Them birds. <laughs> get them birds out there. Alright, birds! Let's go get them. How far do you fly? Oh, yeah, you fly a lot. Six. Get up there. Peck his dang wizard eyes out. Alright. Man, with the lightning bolts. It's just not nice. Uh, what else can I do to this guy? I can bark skin my, my buddy. Uh, let's. Can we get more birds up here? Oh, I can't. Let's put the birds on him. Get him. The birds are the worst. I should put some bark skin on this guy. What's bark skin do for me? Does that give me... Um, um, oh, I don't have enough mana for it. Never mind. Okay, get up. There, get that, birds. <laughs> oh, there we go. We got a, we got a damage. Oh, he's... Emperor palpatining me. Um, I'm tempted to just auto this right now because I think we've got it. Let's see what happens. Surely our guy will be fine and we'll get blasted with lightning a whole bunch. He's not quite as scary as that fire guy. There we go. Ooh, that's good gunshots. Oh, I was going to try to pause it so my guy would get the kill. It's okay. So, we got him. We've got uh, a whole lot of nothing. I was looking for items. That's what I want. Uh, but he's dead now. And... we got to clear out more of the stuff. I'd like to, sit, to have a city, like, right in here somewhere. There's no hills around, but I think... I think it's a good spot. This is probably... Oh, yeah. That is a better spot, and the orcs are going after it. Okay, I know what we're doing. We're going to get those orcs. Where's he going? If there's no one around here that's able to be settled, is there? Oh, he's going there. Oh. Dang, dirty orcs! Uh. We'll have to go take it. Alright, we can, we can handle that. We're ready to kill. Uh, this, this guy, we're gonna go, and we could probably just take that town, also. That's actually not a bad spot for a town, I don't think. It's in this heavy, the heavy woods is good resources. There's a hill nearby, which is good for us dwarves. Um, probably not a bad spot, anyway. Okay, they build it already. They haven't built it yet, so. Let's make sure they know. Um, there'll be no building there. Uh, this, this, uh, this guy can actually do a cool little trick here. He can come out here, and as long as he just spends his turn here, he just collects resources up. So I'm going to let him do that, because he doesn't really have any other jobs to do right now. Uh, oh, actually, there's, this town's growing fast. So I should get another thing. we got two workers there. we got two workers there. We should get another spot in here for him to work, so never mind. Take that back. Um, yeah, go back over here, and we'll work our way that way. dump in here because then we can go and click this drop off our goods into the town Civ with more in-depth RTS yeah I mean it's kind of yeah fantasy Civ okay the town has been built the town is going to fall it does have an archer's tower I don't I've never done a town attack in the game so we're gonna we're gonna find out how this works here in a second but uh, I guess we'll, we'll see I'm going to head on this mountain here. Actually, you know what? This this one, the mountain in the trees actually might be a better spot to build it. Because, let me look. I'm guessing this hill probably be good for food for us. And the hills with trees, forested hills, are going to be better with resources. So maybe we should put our mine on here. And like a farm here. Might be best. Yeah, I want him over there. We're marching in. I don't know if we can handle this, but we got a gun. What else do we need? Yeah, you're about to find out how not to do a town attack. That's right. I like to show all aspects of the game. Uh, I want this guy. We can build a mana well. We can build fairgrounds. Uh, we want to build a mine. Um, actually, I don't think we, we can't do a gem extraction. We can do... What do we want to put here? Hmm... 
Trade goods per level. There's a lumber camp. I don't know. Now that I'm here, I'm... I'm, I'm um, Hmm. I don't know now. Maybe I should stick with... I want to see the terrain. I'm not sure what I want to do here now. I could set the guy on... Um, <laughs> I just saw your comment, yeah. This is a family-friendly stream, sir. Change that town name. <laughs> let's put a Manuel there. You know, man is all good. Everyone, oh, you know, let's, let's do a let's let's do a magic research library. I mean, with that, we want man. Maybe a Manuel. Let's get a Manuel. Yeah. All right. Uh, we're not completely healed, but we're we're mostly healed. I'm not sure how do we attack this town. We might even go to war with him. So we are we are uh, neutral, but he says all kinds of mean. Oh, intend to the dishonorable. How dare you! You will be crushed under the weight of your own ego, Ontinti the Wicked. Okay. 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 Somebody's shooting fireballs at me. He does have a damaged tower. Uh, well, I've got some spells I can cast. I don't have the cool stuff, but I do have a flock of birds. Which really doesn't sound that exciting. Um... You know, of all the things that be thrown out there, like they're throwing fireballs at me, I'm throwing birds. But I'm sure they mean well. Uh, well I don't want to get where he can attack me this round. We're gonna hang out in these trees for a minute. He'll bump up, then we'll go up and get him. We'll stay. We'll stay there actually. Uh, these guys keep on moving up, and you keep on moving up with your gun, buddy. Okay. He just sacrificed one of his units for some mana. Let's get, get in there. Get in there and peck their orc eyes out. Okay. Um, yeah, we can go there. I think that this gives us avoidance. This gives us avoidance of zero. So we probably should stick to the trees for now. And a little more... Mm -hmm. I could throw some thorns on these guys. So as they hit them, they're going to get poked. Oh, they didn't even hit them. Well, come back here and... Yeah, let's get these guys. Oh, easy. Okay. Birds have moved already. Let's get this guy. I don't want to be in the open too long, but let's go there. Oh, my birds! Okay, I would love them. I would love them to attack my birds first. Birds down. This guy's in range, so we're going to get him. Uh, we want you to come up with this. Oh, you can't get there? Okay, fine. Go there. Do a little damage. Um, I want you to take the shot. There you go. I want to see these grenades in action. Let's go there, and I'm going to try to keep you in here. If you've played the game before, let me, let me know if I'm doing this right, where avoidance is like... What do I think it is? Like avoiding attacks. Like a defense bonus. Appears to be... They seem to be going after the ones that are not in the trees. <sighs> They're mighty birds. That's what they are. Just get up there. 
You guys are take some damage. That's good. That's good. Uh, if the owner keeps on shooting you, I'm going to give you some, some, uh, some bark skin. There you go, buddy. There you go, buddy. Now, I hope it keeps on attacking you. Humans are slow. There we go. Got it. I got 8,000 food out of that. What? Okay. Enslave the city or raise the city? Uh, I think we want to... Ens I'm going to go ahead and enslave it because... I'll put it down there. I'm happy with it. My town. Okay. Let's rename this town as... Uh, uh, <laughs> um, somebody give me, a, give me a name. Dogville. No, no. We name it Name of the Birds. Uh, this is... Uh, Birdston. So Birdston is doesn't have any, any like fancy resources around, but it does have hills nearby, and there are 500 people in town. Once it gets a thousand, we'll have some more folks in here. We are getting food. There's some resources coming in because of the road, I think, and the trees because of the trees. So uh, same thing. Let's start with start with a. Um, no, don't do that. Start with a city hall. Does it have a city hall? Um, maybe we need to give it away to get, give it a minute to get the descent out of the way. Maybe. Let's do that first. Yeah, we'll leave it, we'll leave it alone for now. Birdston. And I've got a bunch of resources here. Did they drop it off in this town, you think? They, maybe, oh yeah, yeah, because there's a ton of food in here. Okay. Flappington. I have declared war on Bozork. Yeah, because he's the worst. So he, we know his, his home is right there. Uh, I still have a, uh, this guy ready to go build a, a town. I'm a little concerned about what's going to happen. I would love to build a town right here. Or actually, maybe maybe like right there would be good because we can we could get kind of fill in nicely. I don't know. We should just get these. All this stuff is good stuff. So we got that fire wizard we got to deal with. We got a couple dungeons we got to go into. It's going to be kind of tricky, but I think that's what we want to do. This is kind of free for the taking over here, too. I'm just going to put that settler to sleep for right now. These guys are going to rest another turn. And uh, it won't be long before I teach you some manners, Untinti the Wicked. All right. All right. Yep, yep, yep. Yep. Okay, let's rest another turn. I get to go and tell them to pick supplies up and take them back here. I think we'll sit for now. Okay, food production up is next, and Birdston. I don't know. Um, let's see. Is there a help here? I know that. Why can we not do anything else other than this? Is it because it has just been taken? Maybe we should have burned this town down and built a new one. Hmm. I can't build in a slave city. What am I supposed to do with it then? Should I should I just migrate the town? No, let's export and sell resources, or we should just migrate the town. I said if same if same line and spy wagon will spawn near the former city. So should I just do that? I didn't realize that was how it works. Kanzaki, thanks for following. And uh and put our own town in there. What's the point of taking a town, then, if you can't um, use it? I'm going to have our revenge here on this guy. Taxes. Okay. Always taxes. Uh, yeah, let's, let's migrate this city. Can't go in there just yet. We'll go in there next turn. And a conduit, good stuff. Um, engineers building this thing. All right, wizard. The dogs are out already. Uh, well, I'm gonna put a bird, some birds out. It's an auto this one. We got it. We got it one this time. 
I'm gonna fry my birds a few times. Let me pause real quick because I'm gonna I'm gonna spawn some more birds. Oh man, he's roasting us. Get him, birds. Ooh. We want more birds. Got him. All right. Good. Um, now, that's going to be a tough one. Let's go dump this stuff off. Once we dump the stuff off, then we'll come back to the next, next, next spot, just in case we die again. Uh, this guy's done. Let's go ahead and put a road there. And uh, you. I don't know what we can build here, is there? Yeah. Let's go run back here. Drop off our stuff and then head back out. Okay, Manicondo is up, is is done. Um, Let's go get... What's up down here? Magic library and a regular library. Let's go to warehouse. Okay, population, we're almost up to a fifth person, which will work that. Come in here. Unload your stuff. And let's go to the... Let's go to the... the I think we're going to go to this one. I'm not sure which one to go to yet. Okay, more food production. Uh, I think I actually can send my my worker over to make this this place better to a level two farm. For my civic research, we're gonna work on that. Okay, yeah, do that one first, and then then the production efficiency, and then um, I mean, I obtain per piety by ten percent. Might be good. Methods, let's do that. Let's go get that small government efficiency for now. We don't have any ranches, so we're not gonna worry about that one. We'll get another food one, and that'll be good for now. The volunteers enlisting in the garrison. Great. What's that put us at? Yeah, we got three doors now. Uh, I, I can't say that name, but thank you for following. Let's go into here. So let's see, let's see a dungeon lair. These are pretty neat. So we're gonna, we're gonna head into a dungeon. So this, as you can see, is essentially a dungeon. Uh, it's kind of hard to see it. Kind of lighten it up a little bit so you can kind of see what's going on. But we got to basically make our way through the dungeon. There is two treasures remaining in this level. And there are three monsters remaining in this in this level. I'm just going to auto-battle it so we can kind of see them walk around. But we'll clear this place out. There's the kobolds. Tempted to not let it play out. There we go. We got them. So the last avenger has been killed. We'll come over here. We'll keep cleaning stuff up. There's like food and gold. And, and uh, we'll see what else is there. There's our All the treasures are done. So then we'll go down to the next level. So we want to go, do we want to leave the dungeon and, and, and burn it to the ground, or do we go to the next level? Let's descend to the next level. And then same thing. Next level. This is level uh, three of the seven level dungeon. Um, I'm going to, I thought I almost went with the holy magic so I could heal people just in case that happened. I didn't. Uh, let's give, let's put some birds out. Oh, man. I'm going to auto just for a minute. Here we go. We've got those guys. Got a couple pigs. Um, okay, we'll let them do their thing. Ooh, lots lots of boars. Okay. They're all right there. All of our, de our defenders are right there. So let's go and kind of form up a little bit of a line. And actually, I get there and go ahead and start swinging. Let me get him. Let me give him thorns, and we'll put him right over, right here in the front. Get 
And we're doing that so that my hero can get the kill. No, you gotta hit him. There you go. Okay, uh, this guy isn't feeling so good. So, um... I need you praying, buddy. Uh, just stick back here and, and you can be defense man on him. Strategy Informer. Hey, I, I know that name. Thanks for following. Let's get you, um... Sure, over there. And then this guy is my grenadier. We'll pop him up here and throw some bombs. You're the worst. Okay, good thorns. Uh, let's go and let's... I'm going to let him throw some of that. There you go. Uh, you're supposed to get that kill. There we go. Okay, how are we, how are we doing on, on this guy? He's level 3 now, almost level... Getting get to level 4. Level 5 is, is the sweet spot. Or the sweet early spot, anyway. This 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 room is, is uh, empty, so we're going to let him clear the place out. Uh, we may not need to go... We may not... Should go down any further. We can summon some more birds to take some damage for us. Which we might need to do. We'll go one more. There's what? There's four defenders in here. One treasure. Big dungeon. Uh, let me let me send in some birds. There they are. Maybe more. Um, this guy has thorns on him already. My hero. Well, here let's move him first. A little damaged, but he's got thorns, so maybe he'll keep... Maybe he'll stay alive. Uh, I want you to... I think I'm going to have you just stay there. Maybe we'll keep him distracted. You stay back. Pikeman, you only move three. You up that way. Up there. Still out of range. Maybe one more? Oh, yeah. Okay, well, they're distracted for a turn, so we can... Oh, you can't see them. For there. Um, I'd like you to have... I only got six left, so we're going to give you thorns. And you're going to stay right there. You're going to stay right... Not sure yet. What's your range? You need to move up two, so you need to stand there. So you're going to have to stand there. Hit him. This guy's not going to do me any good. Nice. Okay, you stay there. Uh, yeah, go ahead and get him. Ooh, level up. Um, I'm going to hope he hits the pikeman first. Oh, they're coming from behind! I was hoping they were all on that side. Well, that's not right. Um, uh, um... That's not what I wanted. Step aside, buddy. These guys are terrible. No don't hit anything. Uh, you... Kill him. You, come on down. If I go there, he can't shoot, but I need someone in here to defend. I can't see anybody, right? Yeah. This guy's no good. Hopefully they hit him instead. I never expected them to come in from the other side. Oh, man. All right. Uh, right. Let's see. Yes, they do, they do have a dagger also. Are you out of them? Okay, he has an axe. Let's move him into here. Um, there you go. Can you move here? Oi, oi, oi. Do more damage. He's stuck there. Gotta do more damage. There we go. Okay, these guys can't get in. They're stuck, and this guy's stuck here also. Yeah, kill him! Okay, yeah, we got him. Where's this level... Four. Let's go ahead and uh, pick up our loot. Well, we've lost some things. We're not gonna. We're not going to the next level. 
Okay, uh, we can leave the dungeon and come back later, or we can just burn the thing down. Um, let's leave. We'll come back. We got some fame. We got a healing potion. All right. All right, uh, let's go dump our stuff off. Next turn. Ooh, summon giant spider's done. All right. It's good stuff. Uh, can I tell you to come over here and fix up that, that farm? This way. All right. Uh, we're working on the tree ant. Paralyze. Can't act. Ten oh, yeah, we got to do that one. That's what we want. Okay. Okay. Uh, next one, can we get, um, we're working on a warehouse right now. We probably should start working on some warriors or something. I guess some, some units. Let's do that. Not now, but let's get some, uh, we'll get a few of these guys. Where, warehouse first, then we can make, the, make all the dwarves. I think, yeah, our food storage is all the way full. There's a granary in Civic Research. We probably should go get that. I forget where it is. Oh, no, no, it's not here. It's in, uh, here. Is that it? Granary. Yeah. We should do that. In fact, do that now. Okay, well, we'll do the warehouse, then we'll do the granary, then we'll do the work towards. Alright. Uh, what's going on? Oh, that's a thing. Okay. Uh, increase medication, meditation or medication. Drop off that. And let's work on... That was that spell there. Um, raise the dead. Raise the dead units to fight again for the deity. Only core units can be raised. It requires the magic summoning circle built into these. Um, we can get another hero in here. We can conjure ourselves a nature spellbook, which increases the deity's knowledge and potential magic power in that spell book. There's also spiders. Um, let's try that. Let's work on that. Okay, we'll let them. We'll let them sleep for a minute. Well, just until they get healed up. And we get some more units to join them. There's the spider. Excellent. Yes. Let's, let's, let's get some more spiders. Can we do Can we do that like five times? Let's get some spiders in here. Yeah. Level one spider. Ooh. That's the whole reason I picked these. the nature tree was for those guys. Everyone is fully healed, right? We're at 2,400 again. This is the... Um, that layer's still there at level five. We're up to 1,500 for those seven boars in the next level. So we'll get it. As soon as we get some more spiders. There we go. Spiders back. We got another... Um... Oh, that's done. Um, you can build a road. You can upgrade the road too, can't you? Upgrade that road. So you're part of that group. And... Other spider. How do I tell you? You stay. Other spider, go over there. Um, yeah, work on that next. More food. Uh, it puts us up to 3,000. Can we go handle that with that? I think so. Plus, we can summon them this, we can summon the spiders also. I think we're fine. Um, what's the next thing we want to go for, though? More battle mana would be nice to have, so we can summon more, we can do more there. Let's do that. Okay, next level. Send in the spiders. In fact, why don't we summon a giant spider while we're at it? There we go. There's some boars. Okay. Uh, I can probably auto this one. Let's see how it goes. Good. Got him webbed. That's a lot of boars. Uh, whoop, what'd I just do? What'd I hit? Oh, that doesn't, that doesn't cancel. That does what? Let's descend. All right, this is the final. This is six. We got 15 defenders in here. I don't know about that. Um, let's send in... I only got 15 more. We'll send in one more spider. There's the way down. 15, 15 Wood Elf Rebels. That's not good. Um, 
Hmm. It's gonna be gonna be tricky. Okay, you you uh oh you can do shoot your web. There you go. Well, you missed. No, you missed again. I don't know how to run away. Yeah, we're dead. I also know how to get out. Is this... How do we cancel that? How do we How do we leave? Cancel the fight. Run away. Hmm. I think, I think we're, uh, we're a little hosed. Let's see what this guy can do. Uh, what out of mana? Oh, there's so many of them! Oh, I can't even hit them! Okay, I just wanna, I just wanna leave. I didn't think it was gonna be that much stronger than the last level. <laughs> there's so many of them! Okay. But we don't, we want, like, uh, plug the hole. That's what we want to do. Okay. That, well, that, was, that was good. Let's go and web as many as we can. You missed. Okay. Stop. Ooh, good, good, good shot. You can't see him. Oh, they're very weak. Those arrows aren't quite as weak as the, um... Uh... Thanks, mana. Wish I had some mana. Right there. Oh, there's so many of them. They die so easy. You got that guy poisoned. Do a web thing. And then... Can you stop missing? Can't be missing. Good, they missed too. That hurts. Okay. Um, I think the web is the best because they don't. He wasn't shooting, right? He was. He was st stuck. Not good. Can we hit anything? Okay. Okay, he's still alive. What level is this guy? He's been around a while. Level four. I don't want to lose this guy. But I think I'm gonna. Man. Okay. Uh, you get up there and do your web. You got one more web, so use it. You are the worst. All right, buddy. You got a grenades. Missing. That's what's killing me. There goes my pikeman. Hey, K Biggs. How's it going? We got it. I thought for sure. I thought for sure I was dead. All 
Alright, so, well, these two are going to be very, very well leveled. But it kind of really hosed my army there, which we did previously. This guy's level 4. He's almost level 5. Uh, what are you at now? You're level 4. Same thing as him. Alright, uh, we're going to auto pick this stuff up. Man, that was nasty. Okay, uh, let's leave this dungeon. Found 8,000 food in this place. Found all kinds of good stuff. 8,000 plus the 6,000. We found a ton of food here. Which we could take back here to dump off. But there's like no... Um, there's not really any place to store. I don't think, I think our food storage is full. Yeah, our stored food is full. So we gotta get that... Is that oh, the granary's done and we're still storing too much food. <laughs> well, good thing we got food. Okay, we got um, we got one dwarf done. Um, who's there, ready to fight? Max ban max mana is is the spell is done, which I like that, which gives us uh, thirty one in in battle mode now instead of twenty. Um. Let's get... Let's get some more spiders. Uh, this guy, let's go work on this one now. I think, wait, do I have a up improvement there? Oh, I don't. I thought I did. Okay, come on back. Uh, drop off your stuff, which is going to get squandered. Okay, and rest for a turn. Um, oh, there we go. There's our mine we want. Yeah, let's put that in right there. Okay. What was this one? No, there's another dungeon down there. Um, those are, that's an easy pickings. Let's do some quick pickings just to get some stuff brought in. We got another spider coming in. Who join? Who will join us in a minute? More dwarves next turn. Also, in fact, I'm just gonna stay here for a turn because we got a bigger garrison coming in. And move in there. We've got a uh, another dwarf eventually, but uh, don't worry about that. Um, I think I want to run over here and clean up this stuff. That's an easy outdoor lair. It'll give us some resources, you know. We could easily get that. You could finally use our settler that we're, we're waiting to use. Easy, tough. I can't see that one. Uh, Joe, thanks for following. Um, I don't know what the portals do. I haven't got to that point yet. Create a pair of portals in the overland map that only your armies can pass through. A spell's range is limited to five, plus the sum of the deity's magic spell and all magic schools. Create a pair of portals at a time. You're casting a spell. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. Let's get some more meditation skill. Let's go clean up these acid beasts. I'm going to let them just auto-battle it. I don't think they're ever going to cast these spells uh, auto-battling. So I'm going to throw out a spider there. If somebody gets near death, then I'll pause it and jump in. Unless, except for the summons. You know. He's just there to web folks. Like that, actually. Uh, I want you to get the, get the... Get the kill. Oh, I shouldn't. Uh, you go up here and chew on him. You do your shot. You've done already. You come bite. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Okay, getting real close to level up. Upgrade that mine again. Uh, are we working that mine now? No, we got one over here. Can I tell you to go over here instead? What's that give me? So 19... That's going to be 20. That's going to be 19 there. Actually, that place is actually better. So we're bringing in 20 resources, but we're only using 19 of them because my resource... Because we, we can only produce so much. Beard Man Sky. I think you're following. I recognize that name. 
as well. Okay, trade goods up right ne up next. Um, I want. What's that one do? That's our uh, warehouse. We want. Um, blacksmith probably. How's weapon smithing? Yeah. Probably a good time for that. Finally. Could put one right there. That's actually not, that's kind of where I was thinking anyway. It's two away. It's got the got the um, the deer over there for a, uh, a trapper bonus. We got the fish out this way for so, a lot of food. It's not in range of that thing. But I forget what that is, so I suppose that's fine. I forget what it does for us. So I want you to come over here. Uh, Matt, thank you for following. Lots of follows tonight. I appreciate it. It's paraly oh, paralyzed is almost here. Great. That, that's a good one, too. Uh, working on that meditation uh, thing. Let me get one more spider. We'll come back to that one. It doesn't ruin it. Blacksmith is done. What's that uh, allow for us here in town? It allows us to start getting things like the weaponsmith. Which allows us to make halberdier barracks and armor smiths and bowyers. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get some real warriors here. Real real dwarves. And um, I think when we get a couple more units, we'll, we'll be able to go back in there and handle that thing out. Burston has finally migrated. Supply wagon there, which I um, think... Yeah, I was about to say, we're about to have another settler here. So we'll move this guy. Wait. Oi, wrong buttons, wrong buttons. Right click gets off of him. Let's go there. Right click him. And you are going to go back on this way. Might be a good idea, actually, just to take this wagon and take it into the new town. I think that might be best. Yeah, let's build a town right here. All right. Uh, the town name of Boodegs. Boodegs. So, Boodegs, same as before. We got two folks here. Uh, we're going to go and tell them to go ahead and get a uh, builder's hall, builder's workshop. And we'll, we'll see where it goes from there. Creators are friends, not food. That's right. Okay, spider is here. I now know how to paralyze, which is what I've been dreaming of. You go on in there. We've got, uh, um, what's the put it set? 3,100. You think that's enough to get in that? I don't know. It may not. We can see what's there. we got five kobolds, and then that's nowhere near what the other one was, though. Link. Maybe it's just because of those bows. Those bows were nasty. Do we want to wait? No. We can do this. We're not scared. What was that? This one's done? Yeah. Good. Uh, we can get... So the Armorsmith will lead into other things like armory and barracks this is a halberdier which sounds like a good thing to go we'll, we'll just kind of do we'll run the gambit there and grab all those things and get some real units in here and this guy uh, i'm gonna go ahead and send you over here we'll work on this guy this what do you have on you or just oh there you are, you have ten thousand food. Like what? What happens if I? He's got ten thousand. What am I gonna do with him? What? What can I do with that ten thousand? Nookstone can't take it because it's full. Uh, well, actually, actually, it could hold that food. So okay, answer that question. So go ahead and unsupply. And so now you're just an empty supply wagon. Okay, um, let's do it. I got spells. I have ants. I think I have ants now. I think I have to be in in, uh, in in trees. More settlers have been built. Uh, the orcs are probably going to come back down here. If I know my 4X games. 
Uh, I want you, a buddy, to go and make this a trapper tent, right? What we want. Pretty sure it was trapper here in boot eggs. Um, trapper tents for bonus food. Yeah. That sounds like a plan. Okay. Here we go. Oh, it's a tiny, tiny room. Send in the spiders. Just kobolds. The last level is just kobolds. All right. Uh, we're going to paralyze one of them kobolds. That'll show them. And then we're going to shoot the webs at this guy. He resisted. We can do it that way, too. Think spider blocking the hole. Ooh, there's, there's, there's commander. Commander, uh, kobold. Okay, okay. Let's clear out so, so we can, well, we can't really get out in there, can we? We send the warriors in first? We can send the warriors in. And then, uh, we can, like, um, thorns them up or bark skin them or something. Or, we can throw in a spider from behind. Like, back this way. I think... What's, who is this guy? It's a cobalt hero. How heroic is he? Damage rating 6.8. Alright. Like, if I can just... What if we just web the guy? Oh, that's not what I want you doing. Web the guy. Yeah, how about that? You can't see anything. Can you get up here? Step aside. You can hit people. You're the worst at hitting people. Okay, so I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna go ahead and get a spider in. We'll put him back here, and we'll let Mr. Spider do some webbing. Okay, this guy's gonna be no good back here. You get him in there. Yeah, get him. Okay, and you guys just sit. Oh, I thought I might be able to kill him. He defended up, but he's still webbed. I want you to come over here and get to web and web that guy. Really web that guy. Okay. You're the worst. Uh, let's shoot and shoot. Should move to square. No dying today. Oh, I, yeah, he's not webbed anymore? Okay. Well, there we go. We're level 5. Excellent. Look at the stars. It's exciting. Okay. Over here. And web. Oh, you got a webs. Got him. Okay. This guy's just going to shoot. I want you to bite. And then he's going to shoot the rest of the way. There we go. He's level 5 now. We're very excited about that. And uh, we're done, right? Get to biting. Okay. Hey, Yog Dog. How you been? Okay. Uh, use them last webs you got. There you go. I'll go here and hit him. Yeah, there we go. Got him. Okay. Probably could have been done a little better, but that little uh, bottleneck there is tough. Two treasures in here. We got a whole treasure chest. Good, good. Lots of gold out there, too. All right. That was it, right? Dungeon complete. Burn that dungeon down. We got ourselves an item. Okay, so the battlefield got us that much. The monster lair got us all kinds of good stuff. And we got some fame. We got an item, more importantly. We did lose a mountain dwarf. I think it was a summon spider we lost there. Okay, so that's been cleared up. Uh, my hero, mountain dwarf grenadier, is now level 5. Uh, not the mango, I mean. Mango is level 5. He can level up. So we get to choose what we get this guy. 
So we can give him mind control immunity. Makes him immune to charm, confusion, sleep, all that kind of stuff. We can give him a fast reload, which gives him that. I don't... I don't know if we can give him these. I think we... Like, he gets those anyway, I think. And we choose which one of these we want. Gives him an extra strike on ranged attacks. Of course we're going to pick that. I mean, he... Okay. So he is now cool. Oh, my Grenadier got level 5 also. Cool. Uh, turns the attack into an AoE when attacking with a radius of 1. This is why it's important to not get just folks killed, because you can make them really cool. And I've really been not doing a good job of that. Uh, armor piercing. That means armor reduced by 50%. I want you to just hit things. You can defensively shoot back at things. Increased range would be nice. Um, I think I think I want to give you the AoE. Radius of 1. Yeah, that's good stuff. There you go. Okay, so we're at 2,000 now. Let's go run back home. Uh, we learned of... Uh, oh, you taught me about somebody? Hope we can learn to live in uh, harmony, says uh, says DeGrout. He looks friendly. We learned him through somebody else. I don't know where we know him from. Okay, that way. In that term. Oh, oh, we got a settler. Which I can still build in that one spot if we wanted to go there. Yeah, they're going there anyway. We should go there. In fact, I'm just going to sit on that spot. You can't have it. The uh, Halberdier barracks is done, so we can make Halberdiers now. And I do want to make one before we make the Harmersmith, just so we can see one. Uh, I don't know how to select that settler. How do we do that? I click right there, it goes to the town. There it is. Okay, come over here. Uh, you just stay. You go and build myself as a town. Build a city. What was the name of this town? Um, it is... Um, um, I am playing the dwarves, uh, young dog. It is... What's the name of this? Get, somebody give me a good town name. A good a good town name. There used to be orcs here. Now we're building this city on the blood of, of orcs. On the blood of blood orcs. We call this... Blood is the name of this town. Okay. Let's build this thing. To get some things made, and uh, we've uh, we'll get some more settlers or whatever. We should probably start specializing some things. Like this is going to be clearly a wood town, so we could tell it to work like a forestry town to focus on forestry. We get a bonus to all that. We're gonna have lots of lumber mills, I think, around here. So we can we can try that. Bloodstone. I th I, th I like. Um... Well, I can't click on it now. Blood. Um... Would you live in a town called Blood? Yes, because of the glorious memories of Blood. Uh, of Blood... Mm, blood... Bloodstream. We call this town. Oh, man. What a terrible place. Uh, Raccoon Box, thanks for following. So, you guys will hold and, and hang out here. Um, and, and, and the turn there. Uh, meditation skill. Cool, cool. Uh, I would like some more spiders, please. Can you do that like 15 times? And you are going to give me a road here, I do believe. And in town here, do we have enough people to work that? Oh, he's on the fish right now. Okay. Let them sit. He does have some resources, but I think they're probably better served in this town. I'll drop them off over there. Who is this? Zombies? There's zombies walking in my town? I don't think so. You get back over, get back over here. Defend against them zombies. And, uh, yeah, just rest. Oh, zombies are at attack. Wait, what is it? Oh, this is, this is these guys. I don't really care to watch these. Oh, I can turn that off. Can I just, like, say I don't care about this? Yeah, I don't really care about watching this. I have to go to the options and turn that off. But we can watch the orcs dance around a little bit. And I guess get scared. Because there's those guys are bigger than they wanted. It's just not going to end. <laughs> there it goes. Ooh, they got whooped. Oh, that means I got to go get them orcs. 
Okay. There are mercenaries in, uh, in town there as well. Hey, uh, Chiron, thanks for thanks for the sub. Where's my options? Um, where are my options? I don't know how to turn that off. I'm sure there's a what, there's a button for it. There's probably an F F key that does it, but I don't know how to do it. Okay, go this way. Build me a lumber camp. Uh, I want to do. I want you guys to come in. He can only go. Th he can only go two squares, right? He won't be able to make it in the town. We got to deal with these zombies. Walking through the town. All right, uh, yeah, hang out there for now. Those are the orcs that we just that just. I think it was yeah, it was that one, wasn't it? It was one of those. Um, right, you you sleep. You guys, let's go say hello to some orcs. Oh, we got a halber deer. Good, good. Um, next is armorsmith and a bowyer. Cool. I don't have a specialty for this one. I don't know what to put it in. Increase the mana output from mana wells. We've got a one. Um, this is a unit make in place. Gives any units constructed or hired in a city between 15 and 30 experience per 100 skill. That seems pretty good. Uh, we are making units here. Let's do that one. Sure. Ooh, spiders here too. Uh, I want you to join up. They're just going to stand. Oh, they're, they're gaining strength. That's why they're hiding out there. Let's send the spider in. I don't like how I can't click on things. There we go. Send the spider in. We can run and get him right now, but I'm afraid we'll get whooped. Um, we can't bring this guy with us. And I really want to see what he does. We'll wait a turn. Oh, he's running away. I knew we should have got him. All right. Um, you guys, why don't you give me, give me an engineer. We can use one of them. He'll do some work around here. I knew I should have got him last turn. He's running away now. We can go get this outdoor lair cleaned up. I want to get a town right in here somewhere, so we got to clean up both these things for sure. Let me a road. Um, I want you guys actually to stay here because you gotta. You don't have any moves, I don't think, with him. Oh, do you? All right. Should be a. Oh, we don't see him. Do we? There he is. Hmm. There's a. There's one of the leaders and a settler. There's a white. Two white dragons over there. Couple tigers in there. Uh, he only has the strength of a thousand. We could go get that guy. I'm surprised we can't see his borders. Yeah, they are. So yeah, the tower's eight hundred. His strength three thirty eight. We can't attack that. We can go hunt down his caravan though. And try to get him. This is a good place for a town. There's there's just there's just trees that grow beer in that in, right there. That forest grows beer. So, like right around here would be would be nice. We go, let's, let's clean these things out. There's 14 levels in this thing. We can just go in there and just like, like and just destroy it. Raise it to one level and raise it. Uh, we got the armor smith. Let's go get the armory, and then I don't know how many boats yet. It's funny, when I played this uh, earlier today, um, no, it, it was all, I, I started on a tiny island. I can have one, my one town on a tiny island. And so I had, I had to get boats. Boats was the first, first priority. Did you make a, oh yeah, you made an uh, engineer. Um, so this is going to be... Oh, I don't know. Um, why don't you get me in this town? What's that one lead me to? Oh, the Mason's Guild. 
spotting tower. Yeah, let's go look that way. Let's see what that does for us. We need food. We gotta we gotta grow the town, so we'll have to get that started up. But we'll set someone in here to We'll put a farm on that, that hill will probably do do us some good. Let's go get some tigers. Ooh, hidden tigers. Oh, the harbingers are throwing stuff. Ooh, we got an item out of that. I forgot we got an item. I didn't even see what the item was. Um, oh, a healing potion. What was the new one that we just got? Does it say it here? How do we know what our item was? He should. He should be carrying it. Maybe it was just another healing potion. Not sure what, because it's clearly right. That's the healing potion. Um, is it, oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. No one can take the spear. No one can take the staff. Amulet of doing what? Of... Armor chance one. Okay. We'll put it on to... Everyone else is kind of in the back. So we're going to put it on our, our frontline dwarf warrior. He can have it. Yeah. That thing. Yeah. Yeah. So we should be able to see him. There he is. So, like, it gives him... Um, it just gives him more armor. For him. Everyone loves magical beer trees. That's right. Who wouldn't? I don't even drink beer, and I would love to have a magical beer tree. All right. Uh, this guy, I'm going to send him down here to go get the farm started up on that tile there. And this is... Oh, they built Zathu. You want to go take another town of theirs? I want to live over here, which I can't right now. But... Um, yeah, let's go there. Is that going to be sight? <clears throat> Not really. The thirty five hundred we could we could take that. Easy enough. They just built it. Um Praise on Tinti. Praise on Tinti. Let's go build a lumber camp. Small government efficiency. Cool. We do have three towns, we're about to have four. Um that was civic research. So still got the farming coming in. We'll do uh that'll give us another level of farms. Um Maybe some military research next. We probably should do that. I set this guy here to build a farm. And then we're going to go walking into the orc lands. The baby blue orcs. Nothing more scarier than that. We have a small uh, group defending. These guys have a cool uh, necklace now. Um, let's see if it does them any good. I probably should stick to the, to the trees. I shouldn't die. And then let's summon a spider this turn. I need more mana for each of my battles. That tower's a lot tough, tougher than the last one. Over here and throw your web at that guy. Do a better job. Okay, and then I want to, um, hmm, can I put a spider up this way? Spider there. Let's send him at the tower. Can you, like, throw your web at the tower? That'd be cool. Web that tower all up. Okay, it's good. You got him distracted, though. I like that. You go that way. We get, Those two can handle that guy. The rest of us are going to make their way into the open. Um, you can just going to web this guy. There you go. Is there any point in webbing him again? Web shots. 
Web's gonna be the hits. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, if there's any reason to do it again, we'll save our spot, our, our bite. Our shot, I mean. Uh, let's go and web. There you go. And web. Oh, we got it! Yeah! Take that! And he still shoots. Woo! Nice. This guy's good stuff. Uh, whoops. Didn't mean to do that. I'd like to see these guys... I'd like to see their AoE thing in action, but I'm not going to be able to see it this, this round. Okay. Got a little poison in them. My summon spiders are getting chewed on. this now. Web that tower. Chew on it. Okay. Took all their food. Uh, let's burn this city down. Um, oh, there's uh, there's old DeGreld, which we... Uh, we're not mad at DeGreld. We're just mad at uh, these guys here. Now, to pick another town, look, I can only do it there. I really want... we got to clear this dungeon out, because I want it to be... I want it to be in these hills. Right here, I think would be... Actually, right there is fine, because if we build it on that spot, um, I think we get the mana stuff. Actually, no, no I'm actually not sure. Because if you build it if you build it in hills, you get you get the natural resources there. I'm not sure if I actually get it, if you get it, if you build it in the top. Maybe I should build it there instead. Well, thanks for hanging out, Dog Dog. And Darkness Lily, thanks for following. We gotta go clear this dungeon out. There's dragons in there. That I don't think we'll unlock it until we can build there. So let's go work on that. Um, I got an armory coming in. Let's get a couple more warriors. Do them first. And let's summon in another giant spider. We'll bring ourselves another army. It might be not a bad idea to have another hero. I only have one right now. I don't want these guys to come in here. These gnomes? You get out. Get out. This is my place. If I were to, like, detach one of them and have him stand right there, will you, uh, leave us alone? Yes. Okay. Okay. Uh, we now know how to make uh, lesser tree ants. And that took a long time to research that, didn't it? Let's get burning weapons. Okay, there we're doing that thing. Next turn. Okay. Unit training specialization is going up. Uh, I'm going to tell this guy just to go um, automate. He can do what he wants. We'll build a little squad out this way. We'll get our spider in and a couple of these other soldiers. I'm going to automate this guy also. Okay. Oh, we get a plus hit chance because we are a we're specializing our city. Cool. Okay. Okay, that's cool. I cannot click this unit. Where's my spider coming in? I won't be here for a while. Okay, let's send them over. Burning weapon is done. That's cool. They're gonna come after me. I'm gonna watch them fight again. I don't know how do I turn how do I turn this off? I don't wanna watch the computer fight. Yeah, they're coming down and they're bringing an army with them. They want this place. Gnomes. Gnomes and lizard. What are you? Lizard men or, or gnomes? We gotta clear that dungeon out, and then they're gonna take it. Maybe they're going somewhere else. And they have a dragon. They spawned. I almost took these guys. This is, uh, I think, fire, fire um, magic. 
You can spawn that dragon in there. And cold is a, is a dragon also. Would have been cool. Oh, they built a town right there. It's going to be tough. Um, there's three dragons in here. Before we go sp spawning a lot of stuff. Let's send in... Let's just sort of ease our way up here. There they are. Okay. So, we want to... Hmm. Let's try to get our spiders to, to focus on... Webbing. Okay, so you're going to be up there. There. You have a range, so you can go do that. And you have a range also, so you can stand, like, right there. It's fine. And you go... Actually, you're fine where you are. The breath weapon's going to be nasty, I assume. Grappling hooks is what you've got. What's the damage difference? So, the halberd... 27 hit chance. 2 to 5 damage. Right? That's what it's in. And this is... Better hit chance. No, no. About the same. Less damage. Okay. Um... I'm going to do anything. Okay, what I want to do is I want you to hit first. Let's put a burning weapon on... I should put it on you, shouldn't I? Does it matter what it does? To the melee weapon. Okay. So let's put it on... Is this the cool guy? I think this is the cool guy. Level 4... With the necklace, yeah. Let's give him a burning weapon. Seems like something that would do nasty damage to a ice dragon. Okay, there you go. Oh yeah, the AoE. Um, there you go. Good, good. Hey, everybody. I ain't so bad. Nice. Hey, we damage great. Almost. Oh, we died. Cool. Okay. What kind of loot does some dragons have? It's like mithril. All right, do we go down to the next level, or do we do we go out? <laughs> Let's see what happens. There's five defenders. I have all my mana. We'll order our way up. We'll see where they where they pop up. There they are. There's like displacer. What are these things? Dire wolves. Okay. Uh, does he still have the f the fire thing? This guy, he does. Uh, let's give it to... Let's do Bark Skin on him. And we'll put him up in the front. Over there, I guess. To go beating there. Quite make it all the way in there. Uh, you get up there and oh, even if it misses him, it still does damage to everyone else. That's cool. Ouch! Mm, 
let's go put park skin on another one. I was about to kill him. All out of webs. Hmm. There we go. Okay. Uh, let's go. Let's go hunt. Now, I don't think we can go any further, so we're gonna leave. I don't know if I should burn this place down. Like, it's a lot of stuff we're missing out on, but we could also get a town here. I'm just gonna uh, probably a bad idea. I'm just gonna burn it, and. I'm missing out on a little loop, but that gives us the ability to build. Is this not a build town right here? About time we got mercenaries. Or where they're at. Uh, I could build a. Um, oh, not here. Where was it? I could build a tavern, which will help that come along. Ooh, a musketeer. Cool. Okay, cool. Uh, we got a stalwart amulet is ready. Is it on the hero now? You already have one? Yeah, that guy. I wonder if... Did he die? That's the guy that I had die? I didn't think he did. Let's go there. I wonder if we're near strong enough to take that. And we got, what is that? Some thieves. Mm. 
Come on down here. These might kill us. But get in there so we can at least do something. Oh, they're attacking my town. All right. Not a big deal. We've got we've got magic. We can defend against this. These are uh, my garrison, which does what? They got clubs. Just hang out in the trees here. What do they do? They've got daggers. Okay, so we're just basically going to wait for them to come to us. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and burning weapon you up. And we'll give you thorns. We'll give you all that stuff. And can I hit him from here? Can't, but I can try. Um, let's come back up here. I hear the screams of dad jokes. Okay, let's get a spider to hang out in here in the woods, too. A dad joke? Uh, well, let's see. Um, so there's this guy. Walks into a bar, and he's got a, uh, a newt on his on his his shoulder. Bartender's like, uh, uh, that's an interesting companion you got there. Uh, well, what's his name? The guy says his name's, name's Tiny. The bartender says, what'd you name Matt for? He comes back with, uh, because he's my newt. He's my newt. Alright, uh, let's bark skin my, uh, my, my dwarves. And, uh, get you on up there. How far is your web work? Not that far. Um, we'll let them come to us. How far are they? How fast are they moving? They can come to us. Just like that. A totally good joke. Uh, toads and newts are not the same thing. I take offense to your joke. Uh, get him with them clubs. All right. Um, what do we have here? We've got what did, what did we just get? We got a warrior. Yeah. You sentry. You meet up with him. Uh, and uh, all of you are healed up thirty three nine hundred. Can we try. Out? Let's let's go into here. The dungeon layer. We like layers. Ugh! Are you ambivalent to my jokes? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Keep pushing our button. No, no auto him. All right, so we got these rebel leader dwarves. We hate them. They're the worst. I don't have any, oh, I spent all my mana on that last battle. Well, that's not good. Okay, you up here. Uh, there's a whole lot of them. Let's go do some spitting. Let's make sure we hit when we spit. Do you understand? Okay. Did not mean to go there. That works. To there. And let's, uh... Right, let's do that. That was a mistake. Uh, you got a range. Can you hit... You are a, a, uh, you're a musketeer. I've never seen you do anything before. That's good. Uh, yeah, give him a... It's because I think we'll get level 5 real soon. We got a range. Ah, you can't see him. Ooh, they whooped on that guy. Okay. Go ahead and, and get a kill. Oh, he's tough. Okay. Still one left. Oh, he's right there. Ah. This is level two of five, and we could go down one more, but we got a really hurt guy. I don't want him to die. 
Uh, let's let's leave and come back. Fight uh, tomorrow. Plus, we have a lot of loot we need to drop off with these guys. Um, do we want to go all the way over there, all the way back home to drop this stuff off? It's a long way. Or do we just stay here for a minute? Let's just stay here for a minute. We'll clean up everything at once, then we'll go back. And um, our buddies will probably join up with us by the time we're healed. Okay. Uh, in boot eggs. What do we got? A balloon bomber? Oh, well, yeah. Also, I don't want this. I want you to work on getting me a worship hall. Old piece of rope walks into a bar and orders a shot of whiskey. The bartender hands him the shot and says, There was a sexy little rope in here last night. Is she with you? Sorry, I'm afraid not. <laughs> Fantastic. What do you guys do? Are they like a um, a fighter or are they just like a flyer? What do you do, buddy? That's cool. You got bombs in your hands. I think he's pretty cool. I'm sure he is. Yeah, uh, everyone keep on making your way over here. You rest. You go there as well. And you as well. Okay, we got the helper deer is done as well. We build up quite a force here. And I think with some magic, if I had some more battle magic, which I want. We're working on medication, so, or medication, I keep saying that. We'll get that one done, and then we'll go work on some more battle mana and see if we can get, um, hopefully we'll get a good fight going in there. We'll be getting blood, what did we just make? Oh, we made that warrior, right, for defending. Well, not anymore. He's going to come join in. You all stay there. Everyone else is going to hop in on on this. Oh, are we, ma are we like maxed out? I think we are. Ooh. Mm. I didn't realize it was a max. We should get another unit in. I didn't realize it was a max. Um. Well then... Yeah, I see. I see more of the benefits of like not getting you guys killed and leveling up your your units that you have to make them good. No, oh, you're done. We need to have eight units of really good units. I wonder if it has to do with my leader. Maybe he can only manage so many. Hmm. Savage Soul, thanks for following. Uh, yeah, we're healed up. Uh, mostly, let's get in there. Hang on. Okay. Uh, you do your spitting. You can't see that guy. It's right. Oh, because he's got the shadow thing going. Let me give you. I should probably cast this stuff before. Some bark skin. Okay. Got him poisoned. Uh, you, buddy. you a kill. There you go. Whoops. Uh, yeah, throw your web out there. Sure. 
Uh, ooh. Um, you shoot that one. Get yourself a level on there, or some some hitting. Wait, look. Are you level four? Level three. You're the level four, almost level five. Okay. There you go. Hey, crickets. Thanks, crickets. Thank you very much. Didn't mean to leave. Oops. It's probably the better idea though. We got four Medusas to deal with next. So same thing, we're gonna we're gonna go and rest for a, uh, a day and then we'll come back. Um, our unit's getting cool. Um, what did it say about what did, what did it say about boot eggs? Boot eggs got the worship hall done. Um, okay. I I think what I want you to do in, since it's gonna be kind of a logging camp, let's get this get a warehouse done and um, let's look at getting uh, my guys. Oh, they're oh, they're working already. Okay, cool. Yeah, let these guys heal up again before we go again. We'll hang up. We'll hang out in our, our near our territory with him. Just stay there. I don't have any other items that can be thrown out, can I? Okay, stone skin's done. Is that the kind of magic I want to be working on? Let's get this. What's that do? Rebuff, rebuff growth to a family unit, which heals one to three health at the beginning of each round for two rounds. Um, maybe. Let's get that. Let's get that fire spell book first, though. Okay, we've got some Medusa in here. Okay, so I want you, uh, well, I'm going to put you, I'm going to give you the bark skin. I'm not sure they do what kind of magic, what kind of uh, damage they do. we got four of them in here. Let's see if they're there. So just start spitting. Good job. Okay. Now we're going to put the warriors, get up there. Sometimes it does damage. Uh, and then... Either one of these is going to be able to fire, but not both of them. Yeah. Man, Medusa's not... Medusa's no problem at all. She came in with some scary snake, snake head stuff, but uh, we're not scared of that. I block this guy off. Hey, level up. Good, good. Oh, you get another shot. Okay, right. Uh, oh no, next turn, they, they're all frozen. That's what's going on. I don't know what happened there. Good. There you go. Okay, we venture forth. Watch YouTube video on this one yesterday. Always love stuff, man. Um, it wasn't on this one yesterday, but 
Uh, oh, wait. Yeah. Four years ago, you mean. I, I played this one a long time ago. Cool. Well, thanks, Grant. Thanks for hopping over. Let's go one more. Level five. What's in here? What could possibly be in here? I'm sure it's nothing. It's what? Snakes? Snakes? Why do they have to be snakes? Get the spiders up front. Everyone else can come on behind. Uh, let me throw in a... Um, I'm going to throw another another spider in. So we can see some things. And he can get to webbing. Where are the other spiders at? Let me throw in thorns on him. Oops. My summon spiders are dead. That's okay. Uh, I don't want you dying, so I want you to get out if you can. Do web shots. Let's kill that one. Oh, you're out of stuff. And snakes are hard to hit. Did you go already? No dying, okay? No dying. Okay, good. No, I was hoping my guy would get it. Okay, there we go. Done. Four treasures. Let's go pick them up. I don't know if we leave the dungeon right now. I'm assuming we have to pick everything up. And just sort of let it, let it do its thing. Okay, burn this dungeon down. Alright, we got three items found out of this one. Oh, that's great. We did lose a mountain to a foyer. Missed that. Okay, uh, what do we get? We found a accurate musket, accurate dual axes of extra attacks, and a heroic amulet. So the musket is going to go to... I think Mango needs it. Yeah, it's way better. Go to Mango. Okay. And then the Axes of Extra Attacks. We don't have anyone to take that one. And the Heroic Amulet's going to go to Mango also. I don't know how the Amulet keeps dying. Okay, you stay there. We've got room for three more now. Uh... Well, good. Come on in. Okay, mercenaries. Uh, we got some Hyman Spearmen in here. Yeah, I'll take you. I don't care if you're human. I'll take you. Uh, as far as what we're making here, though, we should probably make something a little cooler, like... Um, well, this is sort of... Built. Oh, what's that? Stalwart's Fellowship allows us to make the Mountain Dwarf Stalwart. Yeah. Okay, cool. We got a couple of, of, of cool folks around. Um, let's move them in this vicinity. This guy has leveled up. Let's level up Mr. Spider. Mr. Spider gets a, a new web strike. What's that do for us? When he attacks an enemy, even if it misses, it's 20% chance the enemy will be snared by a web. Cool. I like it. Um, now, can we make anything... So I think we're going to go clean out these sand spiders. Sand spiders, they get everywhere. I hate them. Of course. Let's get them. Ooh, that big. I want to see what this guy does. He throws grenades, apparently. Can he move further? Oh, he can move real far. 
Yeah, throw some. Uh, let's give him. Let's just put in a, a flock of birds over here just to distract him. No, I'm distracted very much. I'm gonna auto this. You know, you say it looks fun. It looks not so pretty, but um, when I last played this, which was four years ago, um, it was it was nowhere near as pretty as it is now. If that if that if that says something. Another item out of that one too. What do we get? Oh, we got some armor. Light armor of magic resistance. Uh, a lot of people can wear that one. Uh, we should give it to one of, one of our our frontliners. This guy's level four. We'll give it to him. I wish someone could use this these dual axes. That sounds like something we need to be having. This is a level a fourteen level dungeon. So we could like if we can make it through there, we could have a real. A pretty good um, group of uh, units there. Man, it's funny. There's so much stuff. There's so many layers around me. And I played the, like my test game of this, or which I was playing earlier today. I didn't have anything nearby. No, well, no, no dungeons, nothing. Some more volunteers in there. Cool. Uh, how are we doing now? Okay, if we're pretty much full up. Let's go level up. I'm going to... Um, bark skin up. There they are. And... Put some webs out. I'm all out of spiders. You're not very good. Can't see anybody. Where's the guy that does the, yeah. Okay. Let's put in a spider behind him. There's 14 levels of this dungeon. Crazy. You done? Oh, yeah. Everybody's stuck. Alright, why don't you get out of the way so we can get in here? There we go. Get you a kill. Hey, and a level up, too. Cool. And I guess because I because I'm 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 training them in my town, he leveled up already. That was quick. Quick level ups. Lots of gold in here. Okay, do we go down another level? Or do we just sort of heal up and get some mana up before we go down any further? I'm tempted to just burn the dungeon. Let's just raise it. I know we've got some really good stuff out of that, but by doing that, we are allowed to build a town here. That's what I want. Uh, where is my... Do I have an extra one of these? Extra settler somewhere? I thought I did. Wasn't it here? I know I did. Where'd it go? Hmm. I, I know I had one. My settler. Where'd my settler go? I, 
thought I had one. <laughs> How much longer? Um, we can push it along a little further. But I know I, I know I had a settler. What happened to it? Did it get destroyed somewhere? Find some scary beetles. Oh, that's there. Um, oh, yeah. S Saguk is there. Uh, this amulet. It keeps on going to everyone else. Uh, did anyone level up? I thought he did. Give it to him. There's a settler right there. No settling. We're killing you. Man, the AI is quick. Quick to get on those settlers. Oh, they're fighting me now. Uh, this might be kind of tough. They're beat up a little bit. I, I've got 24 mana to spend. So we can, we can bring in a giant spider. Which I think we will do. I'm going to let them go, come to me a little closer before we do it, spit any webs at them. We resisted. Good. We. So they won't be able to. Still won't be able to make it to me. Uh, I'm gonna put thorns on my spider. I'm assuming that's what they're gonna go for. I'm gonna spend the turn defending. They don't care about that spider. All right. Are you sleepy, sleepy spider? I got no mana now. I thought, I, I thought it says I succeeded on that. Man, all they do is put me to sleep. No one dying. Okay, I'd like you to get away. He's been inspired. Well, I'm not inspired by it. I forgot about that guy down there. Uh, I should go get him. Kill this guy real quick. And then we're going to go get Mr. Wizard. Alright, Wizard. This is their hero. Are you going to wake up? He must be out of mana. There we go. Finally woke up. We'll find out if there's a way of, of fleeing the battle, I guess, this time. Alright. I would like you to come over here and do your uh, your web slinging first. Like you hit him. It would be best. Throw them spears. Uh, it'd be nice if you, if you hit the guy. That would be great. Ooh, yeah, there you go. Come to sleep. Uh, you uh, get on in here. Throw them grappling hooks at him. Okay, I want you to have the kill, because you deserve it, buddy. There you go. Okay, we just killed uh, their core unit. Okay. Um, yeah, we're taking that town. First, we're going to go get these guys, which we can't quite make it there, I guess. Um, come over here. There's a settler over there. Oh, they built it. New deity encountered Zinfek has been discovered. We have a wood elf archer here in Bloodstream. Who wants to join us? Yeah, come on in, buddy. I'll hire you. Uh, stay clear of me, weakling, says, uh, Zinvek. Alright. 
All right. Where do I see you at? Ah, green. Goblins. Goblins. All right. Well, they built Borga, but we're going to go ruin that. He's quick. Come over here. You guys meet up with that guy. Uh, there's not much there. We can just take this place out. Can I go with the... I can't quite meet that army. Let's just go break this place. I'm just going to auto this battle. I'm going to... I'll summon a spider out. An auto battle. Is that the road? No, that is. There's a road here. Numbers. Thanks for following. Burn that city. Okay, when my settler gets here, eventually, we'll have a we'll have use for him. All right, Zinfek. This is not not the idea. I don't want to have to kill you too, but I will if I have to. Um, yeah, I want everyone out but the art, the, the elf, because he can move further. Can we move over there? Uh, he can. Yep. They might attack me. Not much there, though. They might land. I'm not sure where they're going to land. I think they're going to go. I think they're going to go the hill or, the, or right there. I don't even have to kill him. I don't want to have to kill him. How much you move on the overworld? Where do I see that? I don't know where I see their movement. World, well, that is world moves. Four. So, like, you can go, you can make it away over here. No, oh, because of the hills. You can't make it there either. Ugh. Okay. You stay there. You, uh, yeah, come on over here. All right, well, we re rearrange our army here in a minute. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Well, I gotta kill some goblins, I guess. All right. Uh, we'll get this. We'll we'll get this army. We've, we've got. Who who do we kick out of there? Our level four halberdier. We got two level four halberdiers. Halberdiers. We'll throw in that. He's a level one archer. I don't know if we want this guy. We'll bring him in, I guess. Oh, whoops. Everybody, uh, we gotta talk with these goblins and tell them we hate you. Okay. I suppose we could have allies or something, but we don't really do that. We we just go in and kill him, and I'm gonna let him just do the thing. Uh, do this thing. Let's go bring in a spider. Take some of the damage. Ooh, they got some shades around. I don't want to die. Uh, I'm going to give you bark skin. And I want you to spit. And spit some more, I guess. Alright, elf. Good. With them fellas. Hi, everybody. I feel like the AI is just kind of dumb. So the AI auto combat isn't isn't ideal. As, as ideal as it is to make things to pass some time, you know, and see some combat. Uh, they're just... Everything's just getting killed. And the big part of the game is don't get your units killed. We can auto now. Watch it. Care worry about that guy. You 
Yeah, I wish the AI was was smart, so that I could speed through this. But I don't think so. Okay, burn that town. And as soon as we get our uh, our our uh, 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 settler, we'll build over here. When you can level up, which one? Oh, this guy. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, it's this guy. Finally, buddy, what do you what do you get? You get. We can give you the city defender ability. Gains one max health, plus one max damage, plus three hit chance, plus three avoidance when defending a city. The swap places ability. Trains train to defensively protect others. You can swap places. Or throwing axe. Give him that as well. Uh, either one of those would be nice. I'm gonna give you swap places because I'm bad about getting people sorted out right. So I'm gonna give you swap. Should I do that? Or should I just throw axe? Throwing axe. I'm doing the right throwing axe. Okay, cool. I'm glad he got that. Was it um, that guy? It was that guy. We got the uh, we got old Bozork over there. Let's spend a turn here. You teach me some manners, Untinti the Wicked. Why? You, what's with the Wicked? I don't know. We're buddies, good buddies. I think they're bringing some friends. Oh, they're bringing some settlers in. Okay. Uh. This can fight them off. We'll rest them one more turn here. Where's the settler at? Okay, next turn. Next turn. In fact, can I just... It'll still come in next turn. Even without working on it. They got boats. Alright, so this settler... We're going to move. This This reminds me of like Civ 2 level of, of um, AI. You know what I mean? Where it's just... Just fill the spots where they can settle, and then they'll, they'll just run away. <laughs> this way. <clears throat> um, we gotta take that town. That's what we're doing today. Before I before I call it a day, we're taking that one out. Uh, man, name an appropriate troop or character. Dirt Bang. All right. <laughs> All right. Will do. Who can level up? Oh, this guy can level up. Oh, do you get more than... Do you get, oh, you're the Musketeer. Uh, fast reload is what? Extra attack on range attacks. Well, yeah, we want that. That's the only thing we can do. Can I attack that? No. We go away from the land, and then we gotta kill him. Aha! He's gonna throw some magic at us. But, um... We got him. Get them settlers. There you go. Excellent. We'll take their food, and I think if we got a name for somebody, it is this guy. All right. Uh, uh, dirt bang. One word. Dirt bang. Excellent. All right. Uh, they may attack me. Well, you know what? They what are they gonna do? Them the pink fellows must be buddies. Oh, maybe they're enemies. Okay. What was that all about? There's a darkness enchantment going on at the moment. No darkness enchantments. Not not when I'm not in my town. Whatever. Mm, the elves are sneaky. You see, they went kind of shady when they went to the trees. Sure. Let's kill him. All right. 
right. Um, my strength of 4,000. 3,000. We might be able to take that town. I'm... He's going to go build there. I think I might I might go and... Ooh, that's pretty good, too. There's a big, big town defense there. I'm not sure we can do that. If I had more... Let's get more max battle mana. I've been meaning to do that for a while, and I keep forgetting. What's he doing that for? It'll be a tough fight, so we'll have to fight this one. Where's the assassin? He's... He's hiding. Okay. Uh, well, spiders away. And then let's go. Okay. Ooh, the, the wagon attacks. I didn't see that coming. That's the assassin right there. Uh, why don't I give you a burning weapon? Ah, assassin, I don't think so. Go bite that wagon. That'll, that'll show it. Know who he thinks he is. Going around. Doing whatever he's doing. Okay. Miracle Gus. Thanks for following. Okay, these guys are a little, getting a little beat up now. Uh, oh, are they coming for me? Mm, sort of, but not enough to really beat me. We gotta kill these guys. I wanna go here, but I think I I have to get the blue guys first. They're our first enemy, the prime enemy. They've gotta go first. We got a good size uh, arm, army here. They've got items. I think we can take them out. All this, I think over here, I, need, I should put you on auto. I've been, yeah, manage everything. Building, you do it, uh, don't build units. But you can do everything else. I'm going to put that on all suits, actually. So, yeah. Everyone can do what they want to do. I'm kind of neglecting these guys. Are you set up as a... Yeah. Produce some things. Um, let's move in here. And... Well, they got a road. So we can get in there. Okay, uh, I've got I got mana, battle mana next turn. Oh, that's what they're doing. Conjure fire spellbook's been done, so we got tangling vines, which I think allows me to get cooler stuff. Um, I'm curious if I do like something like like this. If I do burning weapon, what does that do for me? Does it just does it do it on like a permanent thing? I don't know how that works. Okay, so this is a big city attack. This is our main town, I think. All right. Uh, we'll only have to put every bit of magic we've got in here. And I think we'll probably need some bark skin. We'll probably be the important one. So ideally, nobody dies. We're going to have arrows flying at us. Try to stick the trees as much as we can. A lot of them. Okay. So, go ahead and step up. And then, let's just web. There you go. Oh, yeah! That guy's that guy's a hero. Uh, you are a, um, a one and a point star. I 
don't know that I want to jump out there. Just yet. I think I'm going to stick to the trees. And I think I'm going to put bark skin on him. Okay, the rest of you go ahead and move on in. And let's just get to uh, finishing them off. Elves. We got. Look at the range on these guys. What is that? A spirit talker? Dad joke time already? Dad joke time. Uh, let's see here. Uh, so, I, you know, I'll never forget my grandfather's last words before he kicked the bucket. I know, I had grandfather's last words just a few days ago, but he had other... I had more than one grandfather. And he had other last words for me. Before he kicked the bucket, he said, he, he looked me in the eyes and he said, Grandson, how far do you think I can kick this bucket? I know that one's that one's shameful. I'm 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 a little embarrassed I even told it. <laughs> Alright, uh yeah. Keep on Ooh, yeah, the AoE is great. Um Get to spitting. Get to spitting. Whew. Excellent. Uh, I want you to shoot that guy. Excellent. Oh yeah, our, we're we're good. We're good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Dirtbang is the is the guy with a balloon, the the floating guy with a balloon. Ooh, I'll take that. Oh, come on, you gotta hit it. No, you what? There are what? Here we go. I'll give you the level then. And those archers, those elves are great. I'm tempted to just like play a a round as the elves just so I can use that ability. Oh, you're out of you're out of webs, aren't you? Tearing you up. Um, no one's in range to get that benefit. What do you have left to do? Okay, elves. Good job. Get to biting. There you go. Spider's got that guy. Keep keep to the trees because we want to get shot by that tower. Okay. Now we now we charge. We charge and we throw in a a, a spider to th to to go and chew. Put them in webs if you want. Okay. I'm just going to auto battle. I think that's for now. <laughs> I know. I know. I completely understand. What was it? You're embarrassed by the joke. How do you think I feel? I had to tell the thing. Did we lose one? I don't remember seeing anyone die. Okay. Uh, I say this is a good place for a town. Is Are they dead? Where's deities? Yeah, there's a big blood spot on them. It still says they have 6% of the world population. Uh, you win by having like 60 or something like that. We're at 10. These guys these guys have 17. Theron's got 16. Yeah, defeated. There it is. Okay. We can see what they are. Shadow, fire, nature. Yada yada. Uh, okay. We did lose a unit, somehow. Let's go grab... Who's the best guy to get in here? We got a couple good halberdiers. We have old Derp here. Let's grab this guy. And he's gonna come over here and meet up with them. And we're gonna take out that pink town. And then this is gonna go and build up a spot. And we're gonna go right there. And build a town. 
Yeah, right there. Okay, mod. Excellent. Uh, same thing, I'm gonna let this one just do... I mean, build units if you want. Okay. You do your thing. And, um... I'm gonna keep you over here next to this. Yeah, they're attacking that that layer there. He is in my town. We're not at war with these guys, are we? I forget. Uh, pink. Are we buddies? Yeah, we're only minus four. So yeah, we're not we're not at war with these guys. They're up. Just walking in my lands, though, which I don't think is a very cool thing to do. Go meet up with him. They're going to hang out here and, and rest for uh, a bit. Actually, probably a good idea to run down here. Scoot this way. We'll, we'll set them in, in, the, in our lands to rest. Okay, now they're finally doing things. Uh, we got settlers in, in boot eggs also. Which I don't think I have another place for a settler. Uh, oh, yeah, of course. We can put one there. Yeah, we'll do that. Sentry there. And then you are going to go in that spot where that town was, which I think was right there. Hail, great warrior, says Everlong. Oh, you're a buddy. Oh, yeah, you're, you're an elf. What if I gave you... I'm going to give you 100 gold. Oh, to the honorable. A minor pittance. What? It was a hundred more gold pieces than you had before. I don't know where they... Do we see them down here? Where do we see them at? I see the elves somewhere. Go there and rest. You keep on moving. Okay, burning weapon is done. How does that... Choose a target. Give it to... This guy. So it's just a permanent... Oh man, I should have done it a long time ago. It's just a permanent burning weapon on him? I didn't know that's how that worked. So I could do that with bark skin and thorns and all that stuff? Okay. Okay. We should have been doing that. I should have done it a long time ago. Not we. I won't. I won't. I won't bring you into this. They've got some some fighters. This one may not, we may not win. Let them get healed up. Uh, we can build a dock here so we can build boats for some reason. Um, okay, we're at forty four. They're at forty five, as they are right now. We may come in, and we'll take out their army if we can. Bark skin complete. Yeah, put bark skin on somebody here also. Put that on um, my other melee. Yeah, the melee guy. Bark skin and thorns. Nice stack. So it's gonna be tough. Let's do it. This will be our grand finale of the night. So let's let's uh, let's go out in style here. We're gonna call up the pink guy. We're gonna tell them how much we don't like them. How do we do that? I forget. Diplomacy. Gnomes. We don't like you. Okay. My own ego. No, my ego's fine. We may lose this one. Alright, so we're going to start out with... So he does have bark, bark skin on him. I, man, I could have had such a, so much stronger if I realized that. Uh, let's go and put in... 32. Let's put a spider out for the numbers. And he's going to go and do a little spitting. Perfect. Is he not in range of anybody? Oh, just out of range. Um, we 
more spiders. Because they can do this. Perfect. Alright, now... Same thing, I want you to do that also. Uh, come over here. There you go. Oh, we're hitting them good today. With the spiders. Terrible shots. Okay, that's everybody, I think. Oh, grappling hook, I forgot about that. Oh yeah, and you could throw you got the throwing thing now. Never mind, I got all kinds of more stuff. Thorns on that guy. Maybe we should leave him be. Hit him from range. You guys are free to not get hit by that spider. Good job. Okay, is that everybody? Bowman. Okay, two spiders down. Um, I think we got enough though. I think they did they did the job. Yeah, definitely. That's wait. That's is the name of the deity, Dagreld. Okay, yeah, I'm dwarves. Uh, okay. Let's go. Um, well, we got Spider Man still, so we can we can web him up. Oh, I'm out of webs. Never mind. Um, get up on that tower. Good, get you a level. Spider down! You hit those trees. Maybe we need to just work on this first. Hang in there, buddy. You're not my cool guy, are you? You are like level... What level are you? 
Level 4. You're almost level 5, though. He's so close to being a hero. I'm going to have you hunt him down. We're going to stick to the trees, though. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. So I don't get shot. Hey, I can't hit this guy. Uh, the dwarf bonus, there might be more dwarf bonuses that I don't know about, but the dwarf bonus that I know about, they, um, they can farm hills. Oh, man, he's dead. They can farm hills like, uh, like humans or anyone else can farm planes. Whoops. Okay, tower done. I'm just gonna go get this guy now. What's he just hiding? What is this? My melee guys keep dying. Speaking of, there goes another one. Man, he's tearing us up. Man, we lost a lot there. We lost a lot of good stuff. Oh, man. Burn that town. Okay. Uh, is that... Oh, that, that's pink. They got more. Of of Dagreld. And Dagreld's who... That, wasn't that his name? Dagreld. The name of the hero also? Oh, right. You can, like... If you can... Um, I forgot. You can do things like etherealized deity or whatever, and so your deity like become like comes out into the battlefield. Is that what happened there? I don't know, man. We got whooped. We got whooped real bad. But that was that was the grand finale. Uh, um, that was it. Uh, Thrawn has joined Stargrild in their war against me. Thrawn was who? We met. We met Thrawn before him. The uh, the red guys. We only like saw them for a minute though. We don't actually know where they are. All right, this is end of stream time, so uh, we're gonna go out with a uh, with a little city building. Uh, Brorg is the name of the town. Excellent, and we've we've we defeated two cities. I'm calling that victory. Is there a way to um, uh, admit defeat? I want I want to I want to see the uh, like the final thing here. Oh, there's the options I was looking for. Well, there it is. I knew there was options somewhere around here. Classical music. What's classical music? Oh. Probably not YouTube friendly. Well, maybe it is. I don't know. It might be old enough. I got all these options. I'm just now, just now finding it, finally. Okay. Uh, what else we have? There's the help menu. Mm-hmm. We've got mm, the Compendium. Dagrell, the overall strength rating. Yeah, he's pretty nasty, but not as nasty as my guy, which I guess I don't know how to do that. Physical body to enter the ethereal plane. They'll kill the physical body. There's a way of doing it where like, I go out and fight. I don't know how to do it, though. My items, my wars, uh, my gifts, my civics that I know, um, my graphs. How are we doing? What are we? We are, uh, we're right in here. But pink's not looking so good anymore. Number of cities. Army strength. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. 
Yeah, we're, we're hovering in there. I feel like we could have done a little better. I may have squandered some of my units. Ooh, who's that gold? Elves are rich. Army gold upkeep. The mana pool. Meditation. Hey, was there something? Something was going right there. Oh yeah, we were whooping them. AI normal difficulty ain't so bad. Lost a lot of folks. We got some fame. Got a lot of items. Yeah, they have like, I'm not sure how they got to to zero. Oh, cause he died. Magic research. We didn't do a lot of that. Well, yeah, we're, he's that's 23. We're at 20, so it's not that big of a bump. Trade goods. A little bit. And production. Neat. Uh, those are our wars. How do I... I want to, like, um... I want to retire. Basically. Maybe we can, um... I want to see my map, basically. I'm not sure there's a way of doing it. Um, yeah, I'm not sure how to do it. Hmm. Oh, well. I really want to see the map, but uh, I don't know how to do that. Unless there's a reveal map button. Twice to move. Yeah, so many options in here now. Neat. Anyway. We're going to call it a day. Sorry I don't know how to show off the map. If anyone knows of a cheat that does it, I'll take it now, but I don't, uh, I don't know. So. Anyway, we got we got a little ways into it. There's some of our uh, research. And we saw... I got, I got all the magic done until we can get more spells cast and, and uh, spell books, you know. But... Anyway... Let's call it a day. We'll go ahead and save it. Then we'll quit. And wrap it up for the night. So thanks for hanging out for the night. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll be here tomorrow night. I might not make it. Uh, tomorrow night is supposed to normally is a normal stream night, but uh, I have a sponsored thing I have to get done. And so I'm not sure I'm going to make it for a stream. Um, I, will, uh, I will let you know on the Discord and take this as an invitation to join the Discord. Um, I try to keep that posted up, um, so you know if I'm streaming or not over there. I'm trying to see if I can find a, um, how this game looked when I last played it. I last played it bef before it released, and, um, it was just like, I think that, I, th I thought it was square, it might just be hex, but it was just like a top-down, which it is now, but it was just, it was real basic, super basic. I'm thinking I got walls around the towns here. Neat. I didn't do a lot of that. A lot of ranches there. Cool. Fun game. Anyway, thanks for uh, for hanging out. And I will see you all next time, which may or may not be tomorrow night.